Looks like we're all good. Let's go ahead and play the video game, everybody. Hit that. Go to professional mode. And let's hope this one actually works. Hopefully. Special one. What do we got? Okay, we got the red guys and... Oh, okay, the TMP. Try that. Let's do it. RE4 randomizer on professional mode. I totally didn't just have to redo this intro four times because things were, uh, weren't working. What are you talking about? Is he in here? Oh, he is. You go away. Goes the truck. How much HP does he got? Let's find out by testing on him. Okay, it's moderate. I'll take it. Might take a bit they actually get TMP ammo, though. Welcome, everybody. I hope you're all doing good. I wanted to do this for today. A long stream of just enjoying a good old RE4 run. Although we had some difficulties getting set up, I think we're good now. Okay, that's the one that has the grenade. Let's see. It's not really worth it to take them all out, though. I have a weapon that can't be reloaded. And there's no dynamite people here. Take it easy. Take it easy. I always kind of forget to lower my own volume. Alright, let's do it. Just one little pop with the TMP and we're good. Leon holds this with such force. Now, let's hope that everybody in the village part isn't just a, a bullet sponge. Okay, put this away. I think I hear chainsaws. I see some chainsaws. Guess we should get started here. Two, three... Okay, there's dynamite. Oh, this is perfect. Yeah, yeah, throw some. Throw throw it. Slow her down. Here's the next wave of them. Okay, you're down. We're okay. Oh, great. They spawned behind me. Hang on. Yeah, for those wondering, when I was trying to set this up for the stream, I kept getting, like, the island boys in this part, and they had so much HP that they could survive four magnum blasts. And it was kind of impossible. So I thought it better to just make a new seed. Uh-oh. <laughs> go, 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 go! <laughs> that sound was her attacking. No ch Oh, no dynamite anymore. I should have left those ladies alive. I might have to reset for that. Oh, wait, you got dynamite. It's not going to go off, though, is it? Hold up, we can do this. We can do this. Spray and pray. Okay, line them up, line them up. Oh, cool, there's more. <laughs> I need those shotgun shells upstairs. I don't think I got, was able to grab them before. Let's do it. Dynamite. Dynamite lady's real. And she took herself out. That's fantastic. Good job, girl. 
Oh boy. This is dumb and you love it? Yeah, it's great, ain't it? Let them get close. Oh, it's not enough. <laughs> I got that extra kill, but it wasn't enough. Oh, I did it. I killed enough of them. Bingo time, everybody. Wow, that was pretty stressful. Not gonna lie. At least it was actually possible. Okay, we're not gonna see Merchant for a while, so it's probably best to just rely on the, the shoddy here. Let's go ahead and loot the village. I made good use of that TMP with all the ammo it had. By the way, I'm using one of the, the mod settings to make it so that Leon will stay in his jacket through the whole game. You see now. I keep getting confused of Remake. I keep thinking there's a path here. Man. The Remake Village is just ingrained into my mind now. I'm gonna make mistakes like that all the time. Occasionally, I still try to knife parry in this game. Let's do it. That was actually pretty fun. I mean, for the record, you can actually just camp up there no matter what enemy spawns you get, but that's kind of lame. I didn't want to do that. The reason um, the remake makes you fall through the floor when you try and climb up is literally because they don't want you to cheese that anymore. It's a little reference. Here's this room. Tisk tisk, so unprofessional. Now listen here. I'll show you professional. I'll send a teddy. And there's nothing you can do about it. Boop. I'm a professional streamer surrounded by Moomin and Teddy or plushies, I'll have you know. Now, did I get a chance to pick this up? I did. Okay, let's make sure I got everything. As I couldn't really loot because the chainsaw lady was coming for me. I didn't actually die here. An RE4 Oculus, they're allowed to throw TNT up there now. Oh, okay. Take that there. Oh, looting the opening village section is very satisfying. Pet your plushies? Heck yeah, you should. Okay. So, whenever I usually play some of these, I often say that they get too easy towards the ends because, like, I have too many items and I was good at hoarding all my weapon upgrades. So this time we're going to be playing on professional mode to make it a bit more tricky. As you can see, if you have dynamite spawns, um, you can kind of use those to manipulate into attacking the strong enemies. I don't have a handgun, so we're going to have to make do. Which button? Okay, why? Verdugo on the farm? Oh. I literally called it. Uh-oh. Yeah, this might... This might... This might take a few tries. <laughs> okay. So, you see those medallions? Um... We can't really get them. Oh! The chickens are smiling on our, us today. High frames. High frames. Oh, there's multiple. That's cool. That's cool. They can't climb. Oh, wait, what? Oh, great. The bear traps got replaced with dynamite. Can they get up here? I hope not. How many are there? He's, uh, really trying to get in the barn. Okay. Good job, me. I don't have much ammo, so I can't afford to hit the medallions right now. Am I able to get the treasure in this situation? I could always reset if not. Let's do it.
Go. Go, 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 go. Okay, I made it. Haha, <laughs> I'm in danger. What do you think, chat? You having fun so far? I'm having fun so far. Oh, enemies loaded into the running track. Darn right, you're having fun. Oh, darn it, I want those. I'm taking them. Also, there's some dudes floating because they're replacing crows. There's a lot of enemies back there, actually. How much health are they going to have? Do I have a grenade? Yeah, maybe this is a good place to use a grenade. Although, I gotta try and hoard them for the super chainsaw, guys. Ooh. Good, they didn't have overpowered HP. And I got my shotgun shells back. Cat's eye. Uh-oh. Wait, what? Why is there a wheelbarrow sticking out of the... Oh, that's why. They replaced the dynamite in here. Great. I need them out of the way so I can push. Let's do it. And we're done chapter one. Excellent. 82%? Come on now, I did better than that. It says I didn't die. Oh, that's the last rando. Let's save over it. Pro mode. That's how you know it's intense. Look, Leon's got his jacket. Okay. By the way, how's the audio sounds? Because this is probably one of the loudest parts in the entire game. Make a quick save here. Sounds good? Okay. This is professional mode, so if I let the merchant accidentally die, he's not gonna respawn. Right, nothing in here. First, let's see what's out here. Dynamite Island Boys, okay. Oh, they have rocket launchers. Should be okay. Oh, hey, how's it going? Oh, hey, I'll take him. Uh oh. Well, I missed that. They're already shooting crossbows at me. That's annoying. I gotta make do with what I got. <laughs> that actually got and killed me. <laughs> wow. That's gotta be one of the worst crossbow deaths I've ever had, ever. This seed is fun. Maybe playing on professional mode is, is more entertaining. Okay, let's see what the merchant's selling before we go out there. Gotta select. What are you buying? I can tune this up. The firepower goes up pretty significantly from that. The stats are randomized for upgrades, by the way. The reload speed. Wait. Doesn't this send it down? What are you buying? Treasure map, Killer 7. Semi-auto rifle cost a decent amount. We can take that. A stock for the TMP, the scope. He's selling black bass. Oh. That's a lot for that. This is all he's selling right now. We definitely could use this, though. Is that all, stranger? We're gonna have to do... Oh, fantastic. Hold up. 
Hang on, everybody. Hang on. Gotta... Gonna, gonna sort this for a little bit. I need them up in the top, though, so it's easier to get... I don't have any inventory upgrades, so that's how it's going to be. Just put the TMP up here. You guys can go over here for a second. <laughs> Thank you. Okay, we're going to need that rifle. Didn't mean to open that up. No scope for this, though. Hmm. I can use this if I take a good hit. Let's do it. It'll be like last time, and the case upgrades will be at the end of the game. See, if you hear the music, that means they already know where I am. So they're already, already coming towards me. I need to stay back here, out of cover from the, the bow. And we need to take them out as they approach, because they're all going to be swarming that part. Did he just hit that window? How? He's shooting through the building. Now, if that's not cheating, you've got to be kidding me. Yeah. Yeah, that's what I thought. Someone's shooting a rocket launcher at me now. That's great. Oh, fantastic. Okay, let's take him out. I got more ammo for this thing anyway. When the rifle puts you in stun instead of taking your head off. Oh, that's not good. Yep, they have too much HP. At least they dropped TMP ammo. I'm gonna have to make a run for it. Let's do it. Those are just going to come out of nowhere, aren't they? We've got dynamite. We got rocket launchers. We got crossbows. We have no health. We got everything right now. The explosive barrel got replaced with something, didn't it? Take that. I can do this. I can do this. Nothing in here. Fantastic. Climb, climb, climb. Damn it. No time to even react to that. No, 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 no. Oh, wow. I just had my last iframe. Go, go, go. Health? Nope. I made it. Oh, boy. We're only, like, 20 minutes into this seed, and I feel like we had some pretty clippable moments. Now let's see what we got in here. That's pretty good. No health. I'm pretty sure one of the rules of professional mode is that herbs actually can't spawn if you have one in your inventory. Which is annoying as heck, but I need to be in green right now, so let's do that. Professional mode can, has a lot of annoying quirks sometimes, but it's actually preferred for the speedrun because enemies are the most consistent and manipulatable in it if you know exactly what you're doing. 
I'm gonna say Krauser robots. I was way off. I was way off. Oh, I can't hit them. There's too many of them. Oh, dear. Uh-oh. I'm actually getting away from them. How? Never mind. Ah. They can go through doors. It's really bad. I don't think I can even go for the fish. All right, I made it. Hey, look, Krauser robots. I was right. I wasted some TMP ammo in that room, didn't I? If I hit the dynamite, it should hit him. Uh, bro? Oh, he is just in. I backed into a tree. His armor has way too much HP. Hang on, you know what? If he's gonna stand there quietly for a second, we're gonna go ahead and get the pearl necklace and run by him after I hit the explosives. Sometimes you have to think about which enemies to leave alone, because you cannot kill everything in a rando. Okay. Bro, hit the dynamite! Oh, I cannot believe that didn't count. That was just a waste of ammo right there. You can't kill everything, but you can try. Don't worry, he'll wait while I do the puzzle. Okay. Something activated. You solved it. He's still coming. What am I doing? When I get a handgun, so help me, it's gonna unload. Hang on, we can go back in a second. So, I think in just about every randomizer I've done... Oh, hey, look at my hit ratio. Nice. I always, at this part, I will get, like, Super Mercenaries Mode Chainsaw Boy coming immediately coming for me from outside, and I have to just spend all my grenades or, or die. So let's see if I, ha I get it again. I feel like some rooms have a better chance of having some enemies... Hang on, I still want to get stuff in here. See? Oh! Never mind. Can he come through that door? Oh, he can. He can. <sighs> Let's see what's outside before I reset. Browser bots. He's still behind me. one I don't like these guys I gotta do this oh this is a crusty waste of all my resources but I can't fight them oh fantastic that's what I wanted to see Come on, come on, come on. Oh. <laughs> Fantastic. I'm making this very cozy for you. Well, that's good. Because having chainsaws in my face isn't exactly my idea of cozy at the moment.
Dynamite! Hang on. This is my chance to loot them. Come on, throw the dynamite. Yes! I hate that I have to just continuously use all my herbs as soon as I pick them up at the moment, because I'm one, always one hit away from death. That was actually pretty good. Thanks, ladies. Work smarter, not harder. Oh, you know what I realized I didn't do? I didn't climb to the top of this to get the shotgun shells. I should have done that. I knew I was forgetting something. I talked about this place, but I didn't just climb up. You want to see Leon new lose his kneecaps? Boop. Soft, spongy dirt. Okay, we're doing just great. Did I get the thing in here? Yes, I did. Not the note, though. Who cares? I should be able to hit the medallions now. Oh, what am I doing? No, no, no. Verdugo's going around there. It's not really safe. I'll just go to the church after all. They're not here anymore, so it despawned the music. Can I pick this up? Is there any anything here? I thought it, may, maybe it's mercenaries only. My brain is twisted around because of remake. Teddy Jam, do a stretch? Yeah, I should stretch. Nice, we made it. I gotta say, I'm kind of surprised some of these rooms I've made it through. I could have done the chainsaw room without the uh, the dynamite assist, but you have to make use of those when you see them. Oh. Um, I could upgrade the capacity of the shotgun at the merchant soon, so... Don't need to worry about that. Let's do this. This might be longer than all the other rando VODs, for sure. Professional mode just means... I'm gonna have to do some... Some rooms are gonna be harder and probably take more tries. Let's go. RE4 save music is nice. Boop. Let's pick up the goodies. I think I got decent merchant luck. It's nice that he sells my favorite freaking um, rifle for sure. Oh, there it is. Alrighty. You know what? I don't think I stretched hard enough. I'm going to do it again. Got something that might interest you. Leon has his jacket. Simply because I use a mod to keep it on. Good things on sale, stranger. Hold up. I'm just going to turn the audio up slightly. I feel like it's a little too quiet. But I had it preemptively a little bit down because that siege part where Leon wakes up after getting captured is just so loud. Okay, there we go. Sorry, this PC port is really old and crusty, so it's weird to tab out. What are you buying? Oh, nice. Um, we're definitely going to be carrying this for a long time. Holy crap. The firepower at level 1 is 0 0.7. Damn. But the first one... By the way, the upgrade stats are a little bit random. If I upgrade the reload speed, it goes down. What? Are you serious? Well, that well, That's terrible. <laughs> it's not the original RE4 PC port, though. Oh, yeah. That one was real bad. First, let's see what he's what got. I don't want that. Actually, how much? Mm, a bit too much there, actually. Later on. I could buy the stock for the TMP, but I don't have space for it. Oh, he's got the scope for uh, the rifle I got. That's actually really good. What are you selling? Mm. Yeah, just Is sell them all. Stranger? the wrong button. That old stranger? <laughs> Thank what are you Definitely want that scope. Is that old? Oh, great. Um. Uh-oh. <laughs> I can't hold it. Uh-oh. 
Oh no. Can I sell you these 20 handgun? Discard? No. Let's just cancel the purchase for a second. Ugh. You know what? I'll just use it. Welcome. The upgrade did make the gun slower, yeah, so I don't want to get it. What are you buying? You might think, hey, do you really need this right now? And the answer is yes, because I want it. <laughs> Thank you. What are you buying? We should definitely upgrade firepower for this, because this more than doubles it. <laughs> Thank you. Capacity, I mean, I it's only 7,000. I don't need to hang on to it for the extra thing. <laughs> Thank you. So yeah, if I buy this, it'll make it slower. But I don't know if the one after it will make it even faster than what I have before. We'll upgrade capacity Not for this. Cash, after I sell what something again. Selling? I need to make a little bit of space, so let's just sell 20 of these. Is that all strength? <laughs> Thank you. Gonna regret it what later, I know. Buying? What are you buying? What are you selling? A flash grenade I might want to hang on to. Ah. <laughs> what are you buying? What oh, are you tune buying? Up. Is that all, stranger? <laughs> Thank you. Come back any time. We'll just do that for now. Okay, now we have a little bit of space. Hopefully I can get a handgun later, but eh. Leon's got his cool jacket because he's awesome. Cool guy Leon in his cool guy jacket. Now let's see what we have at the cemetery. Which tree had the thing here? Uh oh. There it is. It's cultists. They have no HP. That one had no HP. Yeah, it's reset. I need to run by them. In that case, it's not going to be worth it to even go for the green cat's eye. I could go for it later. If someone wants to quickly tell me again what um the password is, I'd go I'd go for it. Oh, it's a Garador. It's a fully armored Garador. <laughs> okay, maybe I can't charge in here. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. He's just chilling in the middle of the graveyard. That's cool. And they're already aggro towards me, so I can't sneak by. Okay, really? Really. <sighs> no heal. This is pretty rough. Pretty pretty. There's another one. Yeah. I need full speed if I'm going to get by them there. So if I get hit at the start, it's basically an instant retry. Twitch was airing for you. Oh no, it's not good. If all the teddies can't watch the stream, they'll be upset. Teddy Ursus need their hyper violence, right? Let's do it. This is really gonna suck. Ah! Go, 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 go. Don't tell me what to do, Hunnigan. Oh, that's bad. So we know the shield guys have a lot of HP, so I can't just, like, hit them with the shotgun and be done with it. Okay, then. That Teddy and his jam are so messy today. That's right. I could try to pick them all off before the Garador is, like, aggroed. Maybe I should try and rifle. Because these guys, I can't run by because the giant scythes. Okay, the scythe guys don't have much HP. Ah, oh, he hit me, so it's instant retry. I hate that. This is a bad room. Holy crap. Okay, let's try running through, but this time I'll only use the TMP on the scythe dudes. Because they seem to have, like, one or two hits. Oh, 
Oh, of course he just ate it. There we go. I keep hitting the wrong button. Hello, friend. Welcome to the stream. Welcome to Streamer Reset's very awkward room to get by. He's aggro. Yeah, let's run around the stones. I can't hit the medallions, man. This sucks. I can't get the free merchant item at this rate. Ah, man. Bad, bad, bad. Later, chumps. I hit one medallion. That's something. <laughs> oh, no! No! Oh. <laughs> that was... Not good. Ladies. Lady with dynamite. You're supposed to die. Oh, hey, you living? Uh, <laughs> Where did you come from? I thought you were dead. I thought she was dead. Oh. <laughs> I was doing okay for the record. Content right there. Okay, Chainsaw Lady lived, unfortunately. No! D do you know what happened? Do you know what happened? I tried to kick her and all the items interrupted the animation. Or sorry, interrupted the prompt so I couldn't kick her before she stood up. <laughs> That's what happened. Oh, this is bad, come on. Let me live. Let's, let's try the shotgun here. I could flash grenade, but I don't think it's necessary. They all dead? Okay, you wanna throw that? Okay, now hit her. Okay, beautiful, that's great. We have so many clips from this one episode here, don't we? Hang on, let me reload this. I'm not gonna be able to carry this all. Uh-oh. You know what, I'm gonna have to use the green. Suffering from success right now, yes I am. Dude, these are some of the most wild randomizer rooms I've ever had. The professional is making them even more difficult. Well... No. I want that, yeah. I don't suppose the merchant is gonna go ahead and sell me, um... Something good, is he? I could really use a case upgrade. Really, really use it. Nice job. Thank you, I'm doing my best. Hang on, there's a barrel behind me, I believe. Actually, first, let's go down here and see if he's selling it. He could have it, and I really need it. Like, really, really need it. I may as well leave that handgun there. Got some please, 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 please. Flash grenades for a thousand. <sighs> it's not good. It's not looking good. What are you buying? Not enough cash. I may as well upgrade the firepower of this thing if I need to what use it for a while. Do you think I should just ditch the handgun? It's 5,000 a pop, and I don't need all the ones I have. It might be a long while before I even get a handgun. He doesn't even sell one. 
I'm gonna do it. Is that old? <laughs> Thank you. Extra cash for what now. Are what are you buying? Is that old? <laughs> Thank you. This will lower the reload speed, so no reason to do that. Yeah, let's go ahead and loot. Let's, uh, yeah, let's do it like this. Why don't we? Put the scope down there. I just realized I didn't even put the scope on. Put our blueberries down there. Oops. That'll do. Tuck that away down there, because why not? Hmm. Let me reload this. Fish right there. Let me get the stuff behind him. TMP is a better handgun anyway, yeah. We can't guarantee that I'll even find a case upgrade. That's the fun of the rando, is making do with whatever you get. I'm gonna pick up more handgun along the way anyway, but let me just sell the 10 I pick up here, because I can't do anything with them. What are you buying? What are you selling? Is that all strange? <laughs> this seed is making me laugh so hard, it's great. Make a save. Make a drink. My throat is still really dry because of like all the dust when I was cleaning. Oh, I needed that. We're going to be going all day with this, but I'll take breaks, don't worry. Playing an RE4 rando is a bit of an event, because the VODs can be like five to seven hours. Depending on how things go. And I can pick up the rest of this stuff now, I guess. I'm not going to go back and sell it right away, but better than leave it behind entirely. Hmm... Perfect. I'm still glad people have, like, uh, like, the Resident Evil playthroughs in recent months have been doing way better, which is a bit of a change for this channel. That's nice. I played, um... Oh, don't hear anything. I played Invisible Enemy Mode on a whim for a remake, and that bot did surprisingly well. Kind of makes me want to do a few more challenge runs if I can. What is that noise? What spawned down there? kind of worried. Let's go find out. Will I see anyone as I'm running? Let's find out. Oh! Okay, no HP on you. Looks like he's dead and he dropped nothing. Well, that was a great use of ammo. Uh, well, I may as well use the stuff I got, right? Okay, more of you. Feel like that rock should have gotten stuck? If you start to question realism in Resident Evil, you're not gonna have a good time. Excellent. Perfect. This would be a good chance to snipe some of them and use that rifle. Okay, dynamite is still dynamite there. Wait, what? Is he? He's disappearing. Bro. There, I made him disappear for good. I could just snipe the dynamite right there. I got a lot of big plans for this year, chat. We're gonna play tons of games and it's gonna be great. I'm actually pretty excited for it. Hmm. Excellent. More RE games, more horror games. Lots of everything, really. Let me see. 
It looks like I've played this game before. Well, yeah. Wouldn't play a randomizer for a game I've never played. Uh-oh. Um, I really want this. I really do. Better use a five rifle. Uh-oh. You know what? Let's make room. Wait, what? Flash grenades don't work in water? I've actually never seen that before. Great. Hang on, I need to use on dry land. I, I've actually never seen that happen before. I didn't know. That's wild. I'm still learning new stuff about this game, apparently. Uh-oh. Whatever. I've taken out enough of them. Some of their heads are going to pop off. Let's see if I can get the treasure and get out. Well, of course, replaying games with mods is a fun great way to spend your time, I think. If I can get some souls like... Ah, damn it. Rando's going. I'd enjoy that, too. Let's see. Let me see. Let me see. Come on. He's gonna hit the dynamite. Don't worry. Got the antique pipe. And he dropped a grenade. Perfect. Um... Oh man, hang on. I should just throw these two away. Hang on, I'm trying to talk, but I can't focus. This room's a little scary. Damn. Fine. Okay, that's enough. We can get out. I'm lucky with the gold eggs today, apparently. A chicken dropped one earlier, didn't it? How's it going, bro? Oh, he had dynamite. Okay, now we gotta get we gotta get through Del Lago. Oh, I accidentally walked the upper path, my bad. I don't actually know still if Del Lago gets random HP or not. I just know that like this fight is very crusty at times. Over time I get better at it, but the issue I have now is that the version of the fight in the remake actually um, kind of makes you use the controls or the boat controls in an inverted way. So my, my brain always just kind of like gets confused when I switch between the two and I and I play the two a lot. Um, I don't want to leave that behind. Two rifle ammo. Damn, I can't take that either. Um, You know what I could do? Just take the max health and take the green. I'll make a save here. Welcome, friend. How you doing? I'm glad you like the uh, RE streams on YouTube. One of my favorite to do. Let me see. I was planning to play Resident Evil Zero this week, finally, but um, I'm having issues with the PC, so we're waiting until a few days for that now. Let me just get controls to that again. Figure it out. Now just hold sharp right the whole time, and I should dodge the wood. 
Otherwise, I kind of... All right, here we go. He's going that way. Nope. Stay away from the wood. Stay away... No, he's not going away from the wood. Come out. I think he's going... Yeah, this is fine. What? That one hit the water instead of him. Upsetting. Three hits, not bad. Excellent. Yeah, we just kind of go over here. Okay. This is an okay attempt. He's going near the water. Oh, when he's so close to the wall, I can't tell which way he's going to go, so it, I feel like it's a 50-50 sometimes. Sharp turn across the wood. If I let go of the sharp turn, it'll, like, bonk me around and I'll wobble. Well, I know he's not a fish, but I call him that anyway. Everyone does. Oh, that was lame. He's actually a salamander. I can't believe that. He bumped the driftwood into me, didn't he? I don't think I've seen him do that one before. Where are you at? Leon looked a little weird there. Oh, thank God it's over. Okay. Oh! Leon, are your arms okay? Leon? I think forcing the game to load his jacket broke his uh, texture there. Oh, boy. <laughs> that was fun. We did it. Teddy's win, everybody. Teddy's win. Wake up, Leon. You're okay. So, I have the boat health on me. That's funny. Um, Probably better to use up these eggs first. What we got here? Blueberries. Ugh, I'm gonna need that soon, too. Fifty handgun. That doesn't stack either. Let me reload my stuff at least. Hmm. We don't know for sure what kind of enemy is going to be up ahead. You know what? I should just use up the egg. Let's do that. So we'll take this for now. Make a quick save. I think getting past Del Lago is one of the most annoying parts of the rando sometimes. Just because I'm always rusty for the this version of the fight. Okay, back from a little break. We're all set up. Looks like it's still recording, so let's continue. I'm having pretty fun. I'm, yeah, I'm having a lot of fun with this. That's what I'm trying to say. So before we move out, though, we should go ahead and go back to the the other merchant here so we can get the extra treasure. It would be pretty useful to get right now. Because we're probably going to need more money later on. Usually I don't even bother with this, though. There he is. Thanks for all the cheering teddy emotes. Hope you're all doing fantastic today. You know, on the subject of Resident Evil, since I've mentioned this in a few other streams, I'll bring it up again here. Uh, I can't carry that. Damn it, I can't carry that either. Oh, this is so lame. Um, I've been looking into get into to like t get into tabletop stuff. Oh, I swear I can talk. Don't worry, I'm alive. Got some rare things. And there actually sale. are some Resident Evil board games for um, <laughs> like Resident Evil One, Two, and Three. 
just entire board games with their whole entire expansions and everything. I don't know know very much about them, but I want to try and get them. Have a little fun with that. Because I don't know I know so little about like board game stuff. What are you buying? What's he got? He's got the scope for the mind thrower. Yeah. What are you buying? Yeah, we should get that. Tenny stretch. Oh, hang on a second. I'm stretching. I'll stretch. You waited for me to sit down to do that. How dare you? What are you buying? What are you selling? Let's go down and sell some stuff. I guess I could sell the remaining handgun ammo and pick up that stuff behind me. Is that all? <laughs> what are you selling? But I need to sell some other stuff too. Um, the gold chicken egg I may as well sell. It is a full heal, but three thousand is okay right now. Is that all? I don't really care about Thank it too you. much. Is that all? <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, we'll take that. Hmm. Can always get a bass. <laughs> Could always get the bass. What are you buying? <laughs> Thank you. Capacity could go up to 10. Not worth it right now. Merchants just like, weh heh heh, weh heh There's also like a, like a Resident Evil deck building game. I think it's discontinued now. It's kind of funny because looking at it, it uses a lot of like art from official renders of the games throughout like the 2010s. I love crap like that, though. It looks so silly and fun. Do that. I did see the miniature for Leon in the RE2 board game. It's funny because, like, he doesn't really look like Leon. The hair looks kind of silly. Hello, Mr. Merchant. I'm backstage. Well, now I can get this. Hang on, can I sell you this? What are you selling? Is that all? <laughs> I don't need this handgun here. I'll take the rifle. I really should just go wild for a little bit with some of my ammo. I probably won't have a real El Gigante fight, so I should be okay. Oh, I can't hold that, huh? I have one block left. Well, let's go. You have several sets of that. You play against the other players in a mansion deck. It's fun. You liked it? Yeah, sounds neat. I'm a sucker for more Resident Evil content. I'll take anything, Capcom. Anything. Here we go. Except, uh, I don't think we need a, a port of the Gamecom version of RE2. That one can stay in the vault forever, for all I care. Let's do it. The reason I made sure Leon had his jacket is because the rain is very wet. We need to make sure Leon stays dry as he does this. One of them got replaced with a bear trap. A pachinko machine? Well, that's Konami that does that, right? Rain is very wet. Thank you for the helpful information. It's what I'm here to do. Y'all watch this channel for information, don't ya? I'm here to help ya. I'm here to be your background noise for 10 hours. Or longer. Give me your background noise for the whole day. Uh-oh. Oh, I really want this to... Man, this, this seed is making me choose, and I don't like that. What's my health at? I need to keep, keep one heal on me. Oh, fine, keep it. Keep it, you jerk. I don't even care. Not like I wanted that lime. Whenever you fall asleep, I, a Resident Evil gotcha game? I wouldn't like that, no. That wouldn't be very fun for me. What's up here? 
Oh, jeez. Good thing I didn't auto bump into that. Man, I can't hold none of this. Let's just do this for now, then. I guess all I can do is just spend my ammo. Let's get the treasure before the enemies swarm in. Take that. Resident Evil dating sim. I take that over a gotcha game. Now let's just reload this. Jump, jump. Give me that. There's nothing in here. Or there. Okay, I'm calling it now. There's gonna be a regenerator among them. Oh, is that another? Oh, I missed a spinal back there. I don't care. Let's go. Resident Evil farming sim? That would actually be awesome. Imagine if you had to do farming while, um, chainsaw ganados just come at you. Bear traps and a couple of zealots. That's it. Wow, that's pretty tame. Don't even have to spend ammo here. A farming sim where you run umbrella. Defend your farm from zombies. I think a couple indie games tried to do that, but they kind of just like never went anywhere out of early access. Grow plant 42. Well, can't hold anything. We got the insignia, so I guess we're gonna go fight whatever replaces El Gigante. I feel like farming horror is underutilized. Yeah, I feel like an indie game should come along and do something like that. Like, actually do it right, it would be a huge hit. I think there's something called Graveyard Keeper that looks cool, where you basically run a graveyard. All oh, right, I already got back here. And he doesn't sell anything new at this point on the return trip, I hope. What are you buying? What is it? Oh, the mine thrower. That's fine, actually. It costs so little, but I don't have space for it, so there's no reason to have it. Let's do it. Okay, everybody place your bets. What's El Gigante going to be replacing? You want a vet graveyard keeper, or you want to see that? Yeah, I was thinking about it, but like... Stardew Valley or other farming games, it's probably going to be, like, a super long playthrough that I'll only want to do once in a while. Let's just put this here. Hmm. I'm going to say... Hmm. I keep... I feel like I only get regenerators here. How about a Garador? No, it's regenerator again. Okay. Okay. Hey, chat, you want to see something funny? Anyways, I'm just going to do a little stretch. Ooh, it's good to stretch those muscles. Stretch your arms out a little bit. Make sure that you're standing out of your chair. It's good for your back, you know? Good for your spine. Just make sure you're not constantly sitting all day long unless you're sick or something. There you go. Twist those muscles, and now I can sit back down. Anything? I don't have a hand free, so I can't go ahead and get a drink. Hmm. Oh, hey, the enemy's dead. They literally can't do anything. Looks like Graveyard Keeper is has like uh, good reviews and it's like 80% off on sale right now. Okay, that's cool. Of course I can't combine that right now. Mm, you know what? 
I think I'll ditch some TMP. You know, I'll, I'll ditch one of the rifle, actually. Oh, I'm gonna regret this, but I need to keep the red. No, don't pick that up. Whatever. Now I can take that, because I'm gonna need that later. Farming games are fun, but yeah, you kind of have to break the break up those playthroughs a bit. Dude, you're, you're, you're killing me right now, game. You're killing me. I want the money. It's not going to let me get pick up the money. <laughs> That's great. I have so much ammo, says the man who spent no ammo in that fight. Well, I can at least carry that. Oh, nice, a green. Take any hit, and I'll use that. I really, really could use a case upgrade. A Resident Evil Warriors game? I would love that, actually. That would be sick. This might be my only chance to start getting the medallions now. Why is he looking for items when he can't hold items? <sighs> Whatever replaces the dogs, we don't really have to kill. Chickens? Is that another gold egg or a brown egg? I can carry it. If it's only chickens here, I should go ahead and get the medallions while I have a second. I only need to get 10 of them for the free item. Suppose we could check here. I mean, that is a big goal of mine this year. I want to play a bunch of new games. Replaying some games with mods is always fun, though, but... Sometimes it's amazingly fun to just turn on something random, and it ends up being one of the best games you've ever played. Yeah, okay, that's five of them total. That'll do for now. Hold up. Did I get the nest here? No. Can't carry that. It is very comfy so far, yeah. Okay. Let's go ahead and deal with this part and get it over with. A blueberry, and I can't carry it. I can't carry anything. Holy moly. Sometimes some people's favorite playthroughs of mine is just like a completely random one-off indie game I played. Okay. Go, Leon, go. Oh, I was going the wrong way here. Can't. Yeah, there's barrels here. Let's take them out. Money and a blueberry I can't carry. This hurts to leave behind so many items, but I just, I can't do it. <laughs> okay. And... Okay, that was it. Give my brain a second to catch up. I swear I know how to do this. Yay! Pattern recognition! What happened to Nightcry? I mean, that is a random indie game, but... It's also crusty as hell. I do want to replay it, though. People want me to do that. And now we have to babysit Ashley. Everyone's favorite part of the game. No. No yellow diamond to pick up here. 
At least we can do that. I kind of hope I get hit soon so I could use my triple combo herb. Nightcry is one of the worst horror games I have ever played, and that's exactly why it's entertaining. Don't have to carry Ashley. End of chapter. Save. Here we go. At least I can't accidentally hit Ashley with my knife. I hope. I can't carry this red either. Reds are really important. You know what? Take the dang blueberry. We'll make do with what we got. Oh no, chickens and bear traps! Bear traps are the worst enemies because they're they're the natural predator of teddies. We don't want teddies getting hit. That's not fun. This is completely safe because there's only chickens. Amazing. Okay. We get that. Free gold. I am begging you, please sell me a case upgrade. Welcome. Please, just one. That's that's all I need. What are you buying? Hand grenade. Just one. Just one. Really? The gold chicken egg. Another black bass. Come back any time. I guess we should check for upgrades if we have nothing else to dump our money into. What are you buying? The firepower goes up by Point one. Point one, chat. I feel like I'm getting ripped off a teensy little bit, but what do I know? What do I know? I feel like I'm going to have to save scum to see if the reload speed is worth it. Definitely want to double our um, capacity for this, though. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, let's take it. <laughs> it's Thank still you. an upgrade, technically. Technically, every bullet now does 0.1 damage more. I already got the treasure here before. Can't carry it. Let's run. Come along, Ashley. You're very useful here. more handgun. Hmm. At least I'm doing good with the TMP. No chainsaws here, at least. You're fine. She's fine, chat. Hang on. I'm at the wrong button. Maybe I should get those medallions and take enemies out here. You know what? Let's take some en let's take some guys out. I want to go ham a little bit. I want inventory space, so I'm gonna clear some out. Not that. I got that guy. Plus, I want to take out the medallions in a second. Uh-oh. I have another stack of handgun I can sell. Oh, I didn't get this because Verdugo was chasing me last time. I totally forgot about it. Call Ashley. Whistle at her like she's a dog. 
That's not demeaning. That was a pretty clean kill setup for him. Let me just put it back for a second. We'll make a save here. How long have I been going? Oh, almost an hour and a half on this seed, not bad. There we go. I have a rifle, but why would I do that when I could just boop one TMP? In fact, let's save more and just knife that one. I love how the RE4 remake DLC turned this entire arena into a, a boss fight for Ada. I thought it was a pretty sick part. Okay. Oh, there it is. I see it. Hang on. How many did I break so far? I hear him. That's nine. At least the suplex is working. I wasn't able to loot this area before. We're gonna hit these so Princess doesn't walk on them. And the three shells, huh? Tried to use up some ammo and apparently I've not used up enough. We want to hoard these heals. You've seen what some of those earlier rooms can be like. Really feels crappy to leave stuff behind, though, doesn't it? Hey, And yeah, I'll mention this again for the YouTube audience if they didn't hear it uh, earlier, but there are actually some mods for the remakes now. Like, there's a Nightmare Mode mod for RE2 Remake and RE4 Remake. Apparently, they add a lot more enemies and make the game way more difficult. I want to see if I can get something like that running. Especially good timing, because I got the new PC, right? So I shouldn't have any issues recording and playing a modded high-end game like that. Okay, I already got 10, so I don't need to hit it anymore. Hmm. Wasn't Capcom wanting to do something about that? Well, mm, well I'm not uh, the one modding anything, so I guess I kind of don't have to care. Catch Ashley. That's a lot of bear traps. Bo -bo -bo -bo. I guess I'll poke my head in here. Let's see. Nintendo said they don't like people. They wanted to crack down on mods too, but um, <laughs> that hasn't stopped me from playing ROM hacks and randomizers of that for like the past decade. There's nothing you can really do about it on the internet. I opened it, Leon. She opened it. Okay. Oh darn it. He the merchant gets replaced here. I keep forgetting that. It's pro mode, so I should probably leave him alone. What have we got in the siege, everybody? It's probably all crossbow island boys. Let's do it. Okay, you want to see this ammo get used? This ammo is getting used. Yep. that there. Can they not get in? Wait. No, they're trying. I don't see them. Oh, they have rocket launchers. That's why. Use this. Cool. Thanks, Lewis. Nice. This is actually good luck for this right now, isn't it? Hold up. Just a quick second. This is one of the loudest parts in the entire game. So let me just like turn it down a smidge while we do this beginning or do this part. 
There we go. Someone's shooting rockets out there, and it's making things real easy for me. Because they're hitting their, their allies. Use this. Ooh. Luis is taking care of him, too. <laughs> this might be one of the f most free sieges I've ever had. I usually get the dudes with the flails and the, the shields, and it's annoying as hell. I can actually pick stuff up again now. I haven't taken a hit, though. Maybe it's time to use a little bit of shotgun. I win. They don't have much health. This is actually really good. Finding this, finding this stream pretty relaxing. That's good to hear, friends. Dynamite is free. I thought I'd pick stuff up off the table, but it doesn't really matter, it seems. This is awesome. They just wanted warm hugs? Not from me. I ain't getting them. Let's use a little rifle, too. Dude. Let's wait for them to get a little... Not yet, Lewis. Fantastic. The dynamite guy's got a lot of HP. Enjoy your lurking friends. Doesn't matter if you don't want to participate in chat. It's always nice. I like I finally got hit chat. Don't mean to brag, but that took a while. Now I have inventory space. Okay, he's throwing the dynamite. Alright, we did it. Sick. Oh boy. Uh, enemies killed 141. Damn. That was a very fun siege section. You know why? Because I was actually able to breeze through it instead of just wasting all my ammo breaking shields again. Oh! They're still alive out there. Uh, hold that thought. I'm gonna turn the audio back up. So, because it's more fun, I'm also going to do the Chainsaw Sister route for the rando. There we go. Let's grab some stuff. Leon's got his jacket, so he's nice and, nice and cozy. Oh, damn, I can't carry this. Hang on, let me reload this. That's good. Max health is going up. What about my rifle? Okay, it's full. Oh, there's more grenades here, too. I'm gonna go outside. Man, it's kind of funny that I didn't actually need to spend much ammo here, did I? I'm gonna hope that the mer the merchant is outside and he's going to sell me a case. And we're gonna get whoever's throwing crossbows at my house.
Oh, it's him. He's replacing the merchant. So I shouldn't kill him. Because that might stop the merchant from spawning. My stuff is full. Let's just go. There's usually a ton of enemies on this route, so this should mean I get to spend a... Cr okay. Not gonna get him. Not gonna get him, but I'm just gonna use this. Increase my max health, because I need it, like a good moomin. Okay, we got island boys with flails. Get in. Leon, shoot those barrels on that wagon! Okay, let's back away a little bit. Hmm. Oh, darn it, no. You got a little too close there. Damn it. Okay, no problem. Use this. We're gonna take out this. Oh, no. Yeah, stun locked. Missed anything? No, I just got stun locked. Okay, let's do it. The issue is I don't really have much of a choice but to just unload on these guys. The crossbow guy kind of makes it impossible to route them the way I want. But I need to get that use of that barrel by waiting for the guys to show up. He hit me. Okay, we got the barrel. Now we're gonna stay in this hallway. Oh great, another one. No! Jeez, these guys are terrible. I do not like them. Oh my. Where is he? Where is he? Where is he? Yeah, okay, good. He's down. Let's run. The other crossbow guys are going to hit me as soon as I spawn in. That's the problem. Where are you? Where are you? Yeah, that's what I thought. He's down now. Great. Now we'll take down this these guys. Okay, we did it. We're gonna call Ashley over here. That opening part was incredibly obnoxious. There we go. Crossbows in this game are already janky as it is, but man, you put them in a spot like that. Especially when the second one is set to pop in in the little hallway as soon as you run by them, so I had to kind of stay and route the enemies next to the explosive. So now that we got this, this would be a good seed to get the vest early on, but that's not gonna happen. Okay, let's do it. We're gonna hop down, skip this. Okay, he's down. What? I can't believe I got hit there. Crossbow. I get hit by one more crossbow, Chad. I'm going bananas. I'm going bananas. <laughs> Where is he? Where's the other one? I know there's one more still going. That one is blocking my view. 
Hello, friend. Welcome to the stream. Welcome to streamer is frustrated at crossbows. This is where those blueberries would have been nice. Let's reload. Okay, I got. I took care of them. I can relax now. tilted. I'm getting tilted like I'm losing to a Dark Souls boss now. <laughs> That's what's happening. Okay, where's the last one? May as well take the time to pick up stuff now. Came just in time to see the struggle? Yes, you did. There were some struggle-worthy rooms earlier, I can tell you that. Okay, they're all past the door now, so let's reload and go past it. Let's do it. Oh, yeah, he's stuck back there. I see. Hey, pals, guess what? Guess what? Presence. Guess what? Presence. Let's share a little love with the rifle, too. I love how that's clearly the door they meant for the castle. It's the little lion motif, but they use it in the village anyway. Okay, these guys have a little bit tankier health. Well then. Fine, be that way. This is probably one of the, the hardest times it's made me work for this room. The worst part about it, too, is because I, it would, I didn't even have a boss enemy. It was just the crossbow guys, man. I sound like a crazy old man, don't I? Oh, it's those kids with the crossbows. Give me that. I guess we're picking up anything. Let's take out the remaining enemies before we... Um, do this. I don't have any backup. Look, look how much ammo and heals I used. All it takes is one bad room and bam, suddenly you can pick up items again in the rando. Oh, hey, it's JJ. Did I say there was no boss character chat? I said there was no boss character yet. He kills me one hit because I don't have the vest at this point in the game. <laughs> Play on professional. It's too. It, it's much harder and challenging. They said. Let's see if this is a flash grenade. Nope. Okay, let's go. Come on! Come on! Come on! Come on! Come on, come on, come on. Oh, the, the stream of bullets was right about to hit me. <laughs> I just barely made it out of there. That was one of the worst randomizer rooms I've ever had by far. Oh my goodness. I think it's mostly because I've gotten bad merchant luck. I didn't have um, the right weapons to kill those guys. We made it. This is why I take the hard room, so you guys get your contents, instead of just one random enemy in the El Gigante Hall. That took way too long. <laughs> oh, man. At least that's content right there. How much items did I lose? I lost a lot, and I picked up a few more along the way. I can sell the handgun ammo to the merchant. I'm begging this man, literally begging him to sell me a larger case. Let's take a look behind, pick this up. Maybe I should buy that triple herb from him. It might be useful. 
This is a fun seed though, like definitely one of the most memorable. In the future, maybe I should just play all seeds on professional mode because I'm so used to normal that I kind of breeze through it. Welcome. Best he could do is a fish. Please, 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 what please, please. <laughs> the brown chicken egg is the new one. I'm gonna buy this because I need them. I need more health, clearly. Wait, he sells more? Huh. Oh, he has one more available. Okay, he gets them over time. It's not bad. What are you buying? I could lower the reload speed, increase the capacity slightly. Sure, I'll do that. Thank you. I can lower the speed. What are you selling? Okay, let's sell 70 handgun ammo because we don't need it. Thank you. Wait a second. What are you buying? I broke 10 medallions is... What? Do I not have the free item? Which, does one of them say zero? I guess I didn't break 10. Oh well. What are you selling? Darn shame. Is that a... <laughs> uh, uh, <laughs> Thank you. Can you offer you an egg in these trying times? No more egg locks, though, chat. <laughs> egg lock for Resident Evil 4. Just, uh... I think I should use it now. I'll do it. Upgrading... By the way, upgrading Ashley's max health is literally worthless. Never do it. Like, if you try to divide the max health upgrades between two characters, you'll just, like... It won't even help either of you. And if you use them all on Ashley, like, you're, that's just... You're not going to live at the end. Always use them all on Leon. Unless you're doing, like, New Game Plus... Um, yeah, this should be good. Okay, it's still attached. Good. Okay, so now we're gonna go take out... What's-his-face? He's just past the, the gondola part. A little bit down around. I believe that the merchant before um, the Chief Mendez fight is randomized into an enemy, though, so I won't be able to use it in the rando. For whatever reason, sometimes the merchant crashes the game in the randomizer, so the it, the tool makes it so that he gets replaced by an enemy, if that's the case. So you effectively lose a few merchant slots as a result of that. Oh wait, they don't have... they, they only have taser... they can't hit me, what am I doing? Hey bro, how's it going? Working hard or hardly working, am I right, fellas? Oh, I don't think they like that like work today. Hard times, fellas. Sadler not paying as much as he used to. Oh, we're gonna be understaffed this weekend, that's for sure. How about you too? Yeah, he and him too. Sometimes I get really hard rooms and then I get rooms where I don't even need to spend bullets to kill enemies. <laughs> well, let's go back to the TMP. This is definitely gonna be a TMP focused run. I think a handgun would be obsolete at this point. Let's go pick up some items in here. Excellent, excellent. Do that. Oh, look, there's a grenade. And the thing about flash grenades in the randomizer is you never know when you're going to need them. So sometimes you'll ditch them and then you'll get a room like that with JJ. Where, um, oh, it's just rough. If I didn't have that mid checkpoint in the middle of the, the chainsaw sister route, I probably would have just gone back to the El Gigante road because, man. But yeah, to be completely fair, I knew what I was getting into. Chainsaw Sister room in um, a randomizer is one of the hardest rooms in the game, unironically. Let's do this. He's still alive? Sunk cost fallacy, he needed to go. Oh yeah, I'll take more TMP. That's pretty good. This is not a bad side path right now. 
Perfect. By the way, um, I talked about this last year, but I never got around to it. Uh, a bunch of streamers played this before the remake came out, but... There's, like, a Resident Evil 4 mod, like, for the original. I think it's called, like, Rise of Evil. And it's supposed to be, like, stupid Kaizo levels of difficulty. And a lot of streamers were playing it uh, last year. And I thought maybe I'd check that out, but I never got around to it. How unfair is it? I never ended up getting the green cat's eye. I didn't have time. Oh, well. I'll just combine with what I got then. Yeah, I did only have chickens during the graveyard return, so I could have gone and got it then, but eh, too late. Usually I have too much treasure by the end anyway. Because I never actually really saw footage of Rise of Evil, but playing a game like this when a Kaizo mod sounds like it'd be really cool. Or maybe Capcom will just, like, be send me a very mean email telling me not to do it. I don't know. I know there are streamers that are official partners with Capcom, and they still play mods. Like, no one gives a crap. <laughs> so, who knows? Take this, take that. Let's go ahead and talk to the merchant first. Okay, if I get El Gigante in the barn again, I'm gonna gift 10 billion gift subs. But don't hold me to that. I might be joking. Oh, the brown chicken egg again. 1,200 at least. <laughs> Thank you. I don't have any, ins any incendiaries. I can sell this because I can't get the green one anymore. Still worth a lot. Perfect. Oh boy. Game has been saved. I would love if to not get thrown out of bounds this time too. That happens like every time I fight a boss here. Make sure everything's loaded. Better get that one extra bullet in the TMP. If you would need it. Don't be El Gigante again. Don't be El Gigante again. Gotta do the quick time event. Do it. Okay, that hits me. Only single green there. I need this scenery. Okay. I hit him. Now let's do this. Okay, Gigante is going down. No problem. did it. Okay, nice. I lured him over to the explosive barrel and I got him. Here's the problem. I can't loot the upstairs because of Gigante. No, 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 no. Gigante's invincible, by the way, and I'm stuck out of bounds. That's fantastic. Where'd he go? No yellow herb for me, I'm afraid. Man. He's still stomping around in there. He can't come out, right? Don't think he can. That was actually pretty clean with that attempt, wasn't it? Oh. He's trying to get out. That ended up being an almost normal fight, but it was still better than fighting El Gigante normally. Usually what happens is that the chief splits in two and whatever replaces his legs that are supposed to disappear in a cutscene turns into, like, an invincible enemy. It's kind of ridiculous. Welcome. Got some... 
What are you buying? Still selling the brown chicken egg, I believe. However, I'm gonna go ahead and buy this. Because I absolutely need more health in the long run. Take advantage of his inventory while I can. This is going okay. Remember, this is professional mode, so... I'm, I'm pretty sure one of the modifiers, aside from, like, had the enemies having the most aggression possible, is they deal more damage and you take more damage, right? We shall be fine. And we're gonna go around and we're gonna head back, and that pretty much ends the village section, doesn't it? I actually didn't spend that long on, the, on this section, did I? Really, I'm not giving myself enough credit. I'm doing just fine. There were a few rooms that could have taken much longer, but they didn't because there were dynamite throwers also spawned in. Okay. Take this for now. So when you get to the castle for the first time, that's where the merchant sells stuff like the riot gun and the rifle, or sorry, the sniper rifle. So at that point, he's going to have more items to, sh to show. So let's do this. I was able to get the chief's gold drop, at least. If El Gigante threw me out of bounds, I wouldn't have been able to um, pick up the eyeball. What is that? I think that's farmers. Yep. Oh. He doesn't want to die. Here comes the truck. Okay, we did enough damage to it. Well, I think it was the last time I did a rando here. I actually didn't have any ammo left. So I had to use, I had to time a single grenade to get the truck to flip over without killing me. That was pretty tricky. I wanna grab some extra stuff before we head in. We can do this. It's castle time, Teddies. Okay, not bad. Victory stretch. Victory bears. All right. I'm begging you. Chat, I need all of you to give me a summoning circle made of Teddy Ursa's to tell the merchant to give me the frickin' case upgrade. Welcome. Come on. Got some rare things. What are you buying? Oh, thank goodness. It's the medium one. Is that all, stranger? <laughs> thank oh, you. it's... It, it's... I can do it. I can beat the whole game as long as I have just one upgrade. I can do this. Oh, he's selling the Red Knight for that much? Oh, get out of here. He's selling all the handguns all of a sudden. Oh, do, chat, do you see how close this is to 69,420? That is almost a crime. That is a crime how close that was. <laughs> Why? One digit off. I wonder if I should invest in a Magnum. This one has more firepower. I could, like, save this towards the end of the castle for bosses. However, it's probably easier if I use the... No, I use the rocket launcher for for um, Verdugo. Or wait, it might not even be Verdugo. What am I saying? Hmm. Hydrate? I should. Because you play posted bears, chat, you gave me good luck. Oh, the riot gun. It costs nothing! Wow, I should get this. The striker... Do the striker glitch with that, but it, chat, it costs nothing, and I like this one better. Hi, everybody, welcome. I hope you're all doing good. What else does he have now? Oh, whoopee. Let's sell him the regular one. 
How much can I get for this? Oh yeah, that's a good that's a good trade off. Ah, I'll buy it. I'll have to upgrade the riot gun later, but in the long run, this will be better. <laughs> what are you Let's do it. Buying? Is it. Should I just keep going without a handgun at all? I probably should. Hmm. <laughs> Check upgrades. Firepower to 2.6. Thank you. It's not as powerful right now, which is a bit of a letdown, sadly. But I'm taking it for the long run. Oh, wow. Dude, look at that. That's quite an upgrade. Take that. Thank you. Better reload speed. Thank you. Sure. Thank you. 1.8. Oh, chat, it goes up by 0.2 this time. Not 0.1. He heard our complaints and he answered them with a better deal. <laughs> Thank you. I'm taking the riot gun. You can't make me not take it. <laughs> Trust me, it'll be useful later. Hmm. What are you buying? What are the stats of these things? Red nine is 1.0, 1.1, 2.0. I did a full run with the Matilda last time. Broken butterfly. See, I could take this for the really tough enemies that need to go, because that JJ room made me realize that I do kind of need one of these. I never really use the Killer 7, so you know what? I got the money. Not enough cash. In a second, I will. Sell these. Thank you. Is that... Is that... Thank you. Oh, I actually won't. I'll get it next time, then. Ohio, Syria, how you doing? Hang on, I haven't actually looted this room yet. Let me do that. Boop, 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 boop. That's all right, friend. Catch you later. This will all be posted to YouTube when I can. Tomorrow is going to be set finishing up setting the PC. Or, sorry. Finishing up setting up the PC for streaming. So while it does that, I'm probably going to let this upload in the background, maybe. It's going to be a huge VOD by the time we're done. Uh oh No! If I can upload it in time. Regular chicken egg. Take it. Gold. Ooh -hoo. If I can't buy the vest, it's probably better to invest instead into more attack power. Hang on, is there something up here? Nah. What are you buying? I'll take the Killer 7. Hmm. I wonder if I put it up there, though. So let me move these. You always want your guns on the left side, because that's where the cursor defaults when you open this. Hmm. That'll do for now. <laughs> okay, Mr. Merchant, you've helped me out. So now we're at this, uh, bah, the castle part. Let's see if we can do it. I said that on purpose? Of course I did. I'm the pun master. We got island boys again. You put that rocket down. You put that dynamite down. Where are you going? Oh, he running. That's right, he's scared of me. Uh-oh. This might make it easier or harder, depending on how the cannons are. Hang on, I see a crossbow guy there. See if I can pick them off before they get to me. What about up there? Dude, what are you what are you doing? He's dodging into the wall. Um Okay. Sure, pal, you do that. Got him. Hmm. 
They got rocket launchers and dynamite and they're throwing the catapults. That's fantastic. Okay, first we gotta run to the stairs after they drop. Let's go down first. We could use some money later. I feel like using the Magnum and a Rando is a better idea. Because that way you can kind of... Um, hmm. You have an option to just kind of take out the Super Chainsaw guy or whatever boss enemy gets in your way. They're freaking out up there. I can hear them. Resident Evil enemies are funny. You can shoot them in the face and they'll just, like, not care. Uh-oh. Come on, let's get in here. No, you don't. You do not like that. No! I didn't mean to hit the dynamite. I didn't mean to hit the dynamite. <laughs> he didn't light it yet. Oh, that's unfortunate. Okay, chat. This is uh, take two. I think he fired the rocket at the wall. That's funny. Okay, let's do it. A mere tactical error cost me. Yes, of course. Damn it, what am I doing? Where's that other guy? Oh, there he is. Got him. Hug the wall, hug the wall. Ooh, just enough to make me stunned. Just believe in the bears and we'll be okay. I wish this room had a dumpster to hide Ashley in. But it doesn't to make it harder. They're stuck up at the catapult, so they're just making funny noises. hit the dynamite again. How? Whatever. Ashley needs to sit in the corner. She needs a timeout. And I need... Is he stuck in the, the bridge? I keep seeing like a spark over there. Oh, he's stuck up there. Oh, there they are. Well, that was pretty easy. There's one more over there though. No, that dude doesn't have a catapult going because I already took him out. Where's he at? Oh, he's coming from there. Hang on, I should snipe him while he's coming up. Oh no. Follow me. Sadly, we can't get that gold down there. Darn shame, I know. If you're slick with this room, the instant that you can't use the cannon on the door, it despawns every enemy. So if you just kind of, like, YOLO it, you can actually cheese this room, but it's not really safe in a rando for a lot of reasons. Yeah, cool cannons. Looks like that's that. Now let's get the other stuff and let's move on. And all those boxes stacked up so haphazardly. Check it out. Pringles. No onion rings. What am I saying? Pringles. That's chip. I don't know my snacks, chat. Let me check my inventory. This is looking much cleaner 
Now that we don't have to worry about uh, all the clutter. I can even buy some new guns. Don't need to use the egg right yet. Welcome. Don't suppose you have anything new for me. Got some rare. What are you buying? Oh, nice. This is the upgrade I needed. Not enough cash. What are you buying? What are you Treasure buying? map castle. That's pretty happy coincidence, but we don't need it. Nothing else. What are you selling? Is that <laughs> Thank you. Hmm. Is that <laughs> Is that old stranger? Is that old? <laughs> Is that all? <laughs> That'll do. Is that all? <laughs> Four point four. At any time. The bangle is a bagel. This room can be very crusty. Let's hope it works out. Sounds like I actually got cultists here, like vanilla. So this should be fine. I hope. Platinum sword in. Whew. He was ready to go. Oh, that's not good. You're a little too fast there for me. Um, that'll make her at green. Oh, can I not do double green and yellow? Guess not. This is fine. So now we're gonna put the gold sword in. And now we're gonna leave the room so that we can checkpoint it. You know, maybe that wasn't a good idea. There we go. Look at that. Easy. First try. Can you believe it? Can you believe I just set a world record speedrun for that room like that? Oh. Well, they already know I'm here, so I guess we're... <laughs> okay, fellas. One at a time, please. There's enough Leon to go around. Come on. Everybody wants a piece of Leon right now. Maybe I should use, uh, one of these. Ooh, threw a little too low there. That was a waste. Actually, why are you walking in front of them? What's wrong with you? <laughs> How did that hit her? <laughs> the red ones are spicy tomatoes. Yeah, let's try this again. You know what, Ashley? You stand over here. It's clear that you can't be trusted to move close to Leon. Try some of that. Penny pinching my bullets. Hmm. I actually fired an extra shot. That's okay. The dudes with the red bandanas have a ton of health in this room. Hmm. And the bald guys are throwing stuff, so... Getting a random decap with the melees can help. I actually don't know how the melee mechanic works sometimes. 
Like, do you just have a random chance to crit at any health, or is it only when they're about to die? I actually don't know. Here comes the next one. Oh. Why do they always got to hiss when they get up? Because these guys are automatically aggressive as soon as they spawn in here, it's not safe to leave Ashley behind like you normally can here. This guy is the one with all the health, clearly. The other bandana guy was fine. Alright, let's try this now. Oh. Since I kind of have no choice but to kill them, I guess we can loot the room. Mm -hmm. He drank a lot of HP ups, don't we all? He's standing there minding his business. That's why he needs to die. Nothing? You got nothing to say about that? That's for playing music when I'm trying to work. Really, that was incredibly rude of him to let the evil music play. That's how you know he had sinister intent, by the way. All right, let's reload that. Take that. As soon as I take the key, that's when they're gonna start popping in. We could just run for it. We killed the initial wave, so we're good. The normal zealots that spawn in this location are so stupid that you can just leave Ashley behind and get the key without her being in danger. But those guys were already running through the door, so nothing we can do. Take a look at this castle. How nice. <laughs> Captain Crunch is laughing at me. Okay. So let's make sure we get the free treasure. Oh, come on, I missed. En enjoying a new video game on the new year? That's good. Trying something new. Hmm. Is what we all should do. Man keeps talking about playing new games while playing Resident Evil 4 for the 80th time. That's my streams in a nutshell. I love the look of these, like, little pots here. Little pop noise. I don't think I've ever had bad RNG in the water hall. I usually get pretty easy spawns to deal with. I'm not even playing the remake. I'm playing uh, the original RE4, that's right. Oh, pardon me. I'm a little bit stuffy because it's cold. So what's going to replace the Garador? I'm going to say Chainsaw Ganado, specifically Dr. Salvador. Hang on. Can't see. No, it's just a regular cultist with a dynamite. In fact, can I snipe that from here? The dynamite actually has danger written on it. That's cool. Was cool. We got tomato. Didn't get a whole lot of spicy tomato drops, and I didn't have enough ready for Mendez. Luckily, my firepower upgrades are okay-ish, so I was able to deal with that fight. You think it's cold in the castle? I'm glad Leon's got his jacket. There we go. Oof. Take that yellow. Don't need it right yet. Make sure we pick up some goodies along the way. Remove that pitcher for some cheese. I love cheese. Take some of that. Handgun ammo is just extra money I gotta sell. Hang on, his gold drops disappearing.
I love how the animation of the Garador breaking out of the wall is actually on the wall itself. So it just looks silly. Who builds this stuff? Now there should be a free item I can get here. There it is, I see it. Five shells. Five shells. I still wish I could have my own castle chat. It would be so comfy, but it would be very hard to upkeep it. You need a lot of money to upkeep a castle. That's why no one buys them. Now who's going to spawn over here? Dynamite kids. Oh! Chat, I'm in the continuity where he wasn't in prison anymore. Oh! No! No! Ashley, get over here. Ashley, get over here! Ashley! Why did she just sit there? She just stood there. Why he threw the dynamite and the Garador slashed around. Okay, it gives you a checkpoint when you walk down here, but it looks like I don't get the uh, drop from him no more. Ashley. Ashley is clown. That would be a funny outfit for her. Imagine if she just had a clown outfit and she followed you around like that. It would be like the knight armor. Instead of the heavy metal footsteps, she just like has the honking, like the honk sound every time she walks. That would be so stupid. Um, let's leave Ashley down here since she can't be trusted to make smart decisions. There we go. Her dad might be in charge of the country, but she ain't in charge of me. Um, yeah, let's use the, let's go ahead and take this out. The Garador wasn't in prison this time. He got out on good behavior. Nice, I didn't have to do that. Hold up. No, I don't need to use that one. Damn it, I missed. You know what? Keep throwing that dynamite. Whoa, he, he's doing a little Tasmanian Devil there. He's getting confused by the explosion as to where the noises are. Running out of TMP. He's Newman in circles. He ran all the way over there, damn. Hold up. I still reach him. Sounds like Dynamite Guy took himself out. Follow me. Okay then. What a fun place to fight him. Oh, hey, his guy's going. Please don't let another one walk in. Please don't tell me there's another one in here. Ah! Don't. Don't. Good thing I peeked around. That could have been bad. Would have been super duper bad. Okay, y'all kids ready for the water hall? This is probably I'm probably long overdue for a bad water hall, RNG. I have no TMP left. I have literally seven. I got ten rifle, and I'm mostly gonna have to rely on the shotgun then, won't I? I got a spicy tomato if I need it. And I have I have a decent amount of heals for now. Let's get ready to rifle whatever's in here. Prison escape. Okay. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. It just keeps getting worse every time I hit one.
Wrong button. Well then, if we're gonna have to do it like this, we'll do it like this. Come on. Ow, that's pretty rude. We'll just have to go for it. They got crossbows, but I can pick them off later. I don't want to be friends. Go away. Wait. Follow me. Let's do it. Ashley, why did you walk in front of him? Crap. Come on. Girl, get up. I need to heal her. I need to heal her. She's at full again. Okay. Go, 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 go. Ow. Pretty rude, not gonna lie, fellas. Okay. Oh, really? <laughs> really? She got stabbed with it in the butt. Really? <laughs> that's what got her? Wow, that's great. That's a great way to lose to the water hall. I have returned, chat. I took a little break, just to make sure we don't get too tilted. This room can be frustrating. Um, with professional mode, I take like a couple hits and Ashley's gonna be in the way a lot. You have to remember that with the, the guy with the stun, the guys with the stun rods, right? A lot of the time you see them in the island are during the sections you don't have Ashley. So she's not exactly designed to be with you rooms like this so that's my excuse anyway let me put the bear away Oop. what a wholesome brb screen that is for it okay let's try all righty okay no problem. No problem. Took him out. Take out the crossbow guy before he can fire. No problem. And he dropped some TMP. Nice. And here comes the reinforcements. Man, the crossbow guys got a lot of health, don't they? Let's see if these ones got the same amount. Oh! Dude, I didn't see him. Hang on, I should get some distance. Reload this, switch the TMP. Uh-oh. Ashley, back up. It's a little frustrating to have to take out every enemy in the water hall, but we can manage. Sometimes it's really good just to take a little break during a hard room, because I come back doing better than ever. It's like when I was taking breaks after a hard boss fight in Lies of P, and then I came back and I beat it first try. You know, just take a few seconds to activate the cheats. The cheat being empty the my bladder. <laughs> oh, I actually took them all out. This is good. Fighting them while getting cornered doesn't work because the crossbow guys don't follow. Where's the other one? Oh, there he is. I actually really like this seed. 
it's actually pretty challenging. I still hear another guy running around. Usually by the time I reach the castle, I kind of have a lot of items to work with, so I'm good. Get kicked. No one's shooting at us, so we can just do this at our leisure. This is for all the ammo you made me waste. It's gotta be like a perk or something, yeah. Take a pee and bam. Enemy's HP disappears. Uh-oh. These must be the guys spawned at the stairs. Because I didn't run down there, they didn't aggro. Let's take him out. We don't have all day. Should take a second to reload this too. Fold in laundry while watching? That's good. Should I scream really loudly randomly to make sure you drop the drop yeah, drop your clothes there? Blah. I stuttered on that, now it just sounded weird. <laughs> yes. You enemies should drop down. Nice. Follow me. Let's go. No, I try not to scream during the VODs. Not just because I know a lot of people watch while uh, sleeping, but I just don't really ham up reactions. Okay, we got him. That reminds me of a clip of a clip I once saw for Resident Evil 2 Remake. Oh damn, they're all coming now. Hang on, let's do it. Do that. Hang on a second. Let me just Get them out of the way. No, you don't. Come on, come on, come on. Let's switch to this. Actually, you know what? This is a perfect chance to throw a tomato. Missed the other guy. that. Okay, it's actually safe to do this now. Those stun rods are ridiculously powerful for this stage in the game. Okay, what was I saying? Yeah, there was a dude who did, like, a reaction to Resident Evil 2 Remake, right? Hang on. Now that we've done that, we're gonna exit the room and go back in. There was the part where he gets to Mr. X for the first time, but, like, he did, like, a super exaggerated, like, uh, reaction to it. Where he was just like, oh my god, you guys, it's Mr. X. I can't believe it. It's Mr. X. It sounded really lame. Come on. Because apparently he was one of those streamers that, you know, hams it up for the kids. Uh-oh. Yep. This is fine. Hang on, I think if I can get to the end, it'll despawn the enemies. So let me just get by them. Find out how true this is. Look, there's a crank over there. Yeah, here it is. Oh boy. You got into healthier habits this year? That's good. I plan on doing a lot more a lot more stuff for myself soon. Everybody should take care of yourself. If you're watching the stream, that means you're taking care of yourself. You're relaxing. You're relaxing with video games. Seems like most of them uh, despawned. Oh, this is a problem. This is a problem right here. Guys? 
Oh, they are not going away. Hang on. Still living, huh? Are they even spawning up there? No, I think they're only spawning down here. That's the problem. Actually safe up there. I'm the only one that's in danger. Everybody wants a piece of Leon. Oh, never mind. I think I just saw a dynamite dude. Oh, you got a migraine tonight? Sorry to hear that. Oh, I didn't shatter that. God damn it. No problem. Ooh. I got stun locked. Yeah, I don't think this enemy type can actually spawn where Ashley is. So maybe it's because I usually get cultists in this room. So that means the cultist spawns can always track Ashley down. But... Wait, that yeah, that's true. Only the cultists would be programmed to go after Ashley during this part. So, of course, they're only going to hop down and come for me. Okay. This is just a mini siege, then. Also, yeah, it despawned the enemies. So maybe I have an easier time now. Let me go ahead and loot this before I start it. Oh, right. I remember the trick now the speedrun uses. As soon as you hit the cutscene of Ashley pointing to the crank, just instantly pause and, re and hit retry, and you'll load in and despawn the enemies. That's what I meant. I know what I'm talking about in this game, I swear. Get on up there, you can do it. Watch out for me. Yeah, they're only coming down for Leon. Oh, never mind. Never mind, now they're actually going for her. I messed it up. Okay, buddy. See, what you just did there is what we call frickin' rude. Well, now we gotta deal with Ashley. Hang on, I'll just do this. Oh, that's fantastic. Oh, yeah. Wait, he can't hop down from here. Oh, this is actually good. Spawn things. Oh, hi, Lorelai. How you doing? You've been lurking? Oh, okay. I thought you might want to show up for RE4. Okay. How badly did you see me fail earlier? I hope not at all. Oopsie. Excellent. No way. Should only show up and watch the rooms I did impressively in one try. Otherwise, it doesn't count. This is why I like the sniper rifle in this game. Oh, you were playing games with a friend while watching. Okay. Move that here. Which reminds me, I wanted to tell you later that I do want to make plans to play Baldur's Gate with you sometime. Because I never really got around to a lot of social plans the past few uh, months here. Take him out. Oh. My goodness. There we go. I keep opening the map button because the button that opens the inventory for a remake is that button. Didn't take him out. Anyway, we made it. We can go. I want to get back into playing Baldur's Gate 3, but, um, I'm not used to those kinds of games at all, so every time I learn how one mechanic works, I just want to remake my entire character and start over from scratch. Well, we actually made it through. Waterhall is kind of... kind of poopy sometimes, isn't it? In Remake, the water there is actually poopy water, too, so it fits. Let's see... The vanilla game isn't very hard for me anymore, <laughs> but in randomizers, when enemies like that pop in, oh boy. Take that. 
Before I check the merchants. Hand grenade, get that lime. That's right, you can also just play on easy and figure things out. Let's go. I feel like I shouldn't play hard mode for, for games first on the first playthrough, though. That never really works out for me. Unless a game specifically tells me that, like, hard mode is the way the game was initially designed, I don't really want to do a first playthrough of anything on it. Because you don't know how hard hard mode is actually going to be. Welcome. Got some rare... What are you buying? Okay, we can tune this up. We can lower its reload. We can lower the reload speed for seven thousand pitas. We can increase the capacity. I think one of the worst examples, um, worst examples of a hard mode ever is probably Digimon Cyber Sleuth. If you play Digimon Cyber Sleuth, never play it on hard mode because it they didn't even like test it properly. All they did was add a multiplier to enemy stats, right? And I think in the initial release, it was just times two for all enemy stats. And some super bosses in the end game literally can't even be beaten without a very specific team build. It was so bad that in the uh, the collection re-release, they made it 1.5 instead. Excellent. It's weird to see me struggle with this game. Well, randomizers are random. Remember, I only have one inventory upgrade and... Hmm... I think the big thing right now is just my health and not having the vest. I was kind of hoping to get the vest early, but that didn't work out. Anyways, I picked up all I could. And you know what? Let me double check something if he has another triple. What are you buying? I want to see if he's selling those again. No, he doesn't have them, but he is selling this for 4,000. That's kind of a steal for a full heal, so I'll take it. Hmm. <laughs> Thank you. Hmm. All right, let's make a save and do this. You know why this next part is good? Because it's where we get to ditch Ashley for a little bit. Three hours. Doesn't feel like it. We're going to the sewers. What's going to replace the Invisibugs? If a game is designed to be super hard, I I definitely enjoy, like, throwing my head against the wall until I beat it. Like with a Souls-like or something. Let me see here. Usually when a game has a normal mode, though, I assume the normal mode is a balanced difficulty. Let me see. I appreciate when games have a little indicator, though, when you're selecting the difficulty. Like, I guess RE4 Remake is a good example of that. Like, um, when you boot it up for the first time, it tells you that Hardcore Mode is intended for people who beat the original RE4 already. Which, I really appreciate that idea. And they- and the Normal Mode is designed for people who haven't played the original RE4. You see. So, of course, I had to play on Hardcore Mode for my first run of that. And I did. It was actually pretty hardcore, I appreciated it. The opening village section is pretty brutal when you're first getting used to it. Professional mode is in that game, though, is pretty wild. Your knife parries have to be perfect, and... Most people just kind of go through it on new, with New Game Plus weapons for the achievement. Hmm. What is that? I think it's a snake. Yeah, it is a snake. What is it doing? I guess it's invincible like that. That's weird. Um, hang on. What's my current health? I could just eat this egg. Even in a series, hard modes can be very inconsistent. Like, uh, I guess another... If I was to choose for Resident Evil, um... In Resident Evil 1 Remake, I think the hard mode is really good. I think it's pretty well balanced for someone uh, to enjoy. Oops. If they're a bit familiar with the game or want a challenge right away. But 
The hard mode in Resident Evil Zero, which is made in the same engine and has like a same visual style. I'll just eat it. That hard mode is stupid and annoying. Talked about it before, but it's a game... It's a mode where you're recommended to learn how to knife the first boss so you can save enough ammo to actually kill things later. Okay. That's just the Luis memo. I haven't seen any enemies yet. Wait a second. No, the snakes. The snakes are replacing the invisible bugs. I do it. I got a free room here. Door's too rusted to budge. Let's go over here. I think the worst way to implement a hard mode, though, is to require two consoles and two copies of the game, and it only activates after you beat it. <laughs> cough, cough, black and white, too. Kick that open. Excellent. Not only that, but I, I, I seem to remember... Isn't it, like, for the hardcore mode in Pokemon Black and White 2, didn't they, like, mess it up and the enemies, or the enemy Pokemon actually have the stats of normal mode, but their physical level is increased, so it's just kind of fake? I think I remember hearing something about that. I should reload the rifle. That's what I can do. I haven't been finding rifle ammo now that I think about it. I kind of just spent it all and I assumed I'd get more, but I haven't. Should reload the TMP as well. Normal mode is Weenie Hut Jr. No, don't say that. Don't call me a fake gamer for playing on normal mode. Bro, people can play on easy mode for all I care. I never understood getting mad at people who won't want to buy a game and just enjoy it on easy. Like, that don't matter to me. Let's go. Hello, friend. Welcome to the stream. Hello to you, too, from Canada. Oh, spiders. Doesn't look like they're dropping much. This is a free sewer, basically. Not bad. Hmm. Give me that. I think they're chasing me, but it kind of doesn't matter, does it? And we're done. Don't ask why there's swinging pendulums here. There just are. Salazar just loves to have that there for some reason. Excellent. Uh-oh. They're, they're already moving. I literally can't get them. They spawned in aggroed. I can't get the treasure, can I? I can at least get the pendant off him. Too bad I can't get all the spinal drops from the others. Can't believe I missed him. Finally, he's down. No spinal? Well, that's lame. Okay, sewers dealt with. Now we can go upstairs here. I always kind of forget what to do sometimes. Yeah, ever since remake came out, I get Brent, my, I get everything mixed up. Oh wait, I I totally forgot. I got confused here because those guys are were already running, but I need to run up here again so I can get the treasure on the other side. Treasure is good. And this is sealed off, right? Yeah, I gotta go around. Just use the chandelier. Can't be safe to stand on one of those. Chandeliers are heavy, but I'm reasonably certain that they're not designed to hold a human. And again, the chains are probably massive, but they could be old. 
Okay, what am I doing? The lever for open everything up is over here. And we're done. I don't even remember what this treasure is. Oh, it's the mask. Well, I have two gems to fit inside it. I can never get the third one, though. I never remember where it is. Sometimes you just want to grab a little bit of sparkly rocks and sell it to the merchant for some good stuff. Oh, here. Hmm. Oh, I just realized the, that one enemy that didn't drop a spinal, that was the merchant replacement. I hope killing him didn't despawn the merchant. It damn well better not. Otherwise, I see other YouTubers deal with that a lot more. Hang on, let's reload while we have a second. Put this in. I still have the Magnum, but nothing extremely important to use it on. Uh-oh, I see a chainsaw, but I also see dynamite. Hold up. <sighs> really? Well, we live with our mistakes, Jimbo. Oh, is that a chainsaw? That chainsaw behind me? That's a chainsaw behind me. I think because a chainsaw guy isn't normally in here, the game doesn't load that in. Hang on, if they're going to throw dynamite, they might get the guy who has the key. He's dead. He didn't have much health. I don't think I usually see chainsaw ganados in the castle. Oh, I already spent all my rifle. Oopsie poopsie. I should try some more multiplayer stuff, chat. I kind of want to do that for this year. Not, like, on stream exactly. Mostly just in general. More recently, my brother has been inviting me to join him for streaming Lethal Company. I've done a few streams of that. Those were really fun. I'd like to play more of that. That's probably the only stream, though, where I have actually had done... Had screamed a little. <laughs> Unintentionally. <clears throat> okay. See if I can get him from here. Looks like he's done. <clears throat> or get stuck in the wall. Yeah, I got stuck in the wall sometimes. Victory stretch? Yes, I should. If I stretch and get killed by a chainsaw, I'm gonna ban a chat member for that. <clears throat> I'm joking. I wouldn't do that. I'm not that petty. Despite what you may have heard from Goku420. Goku420 is just a generic username I make fun of. As general comments, you know what I mean. He got a sickle. Oh, he's trying to dodge. Bro. How did I miss that? Come on. Chat members are now volunteering to be banned. What's wrong with you? Why would you want to do that? If you get banned, you can't watch this awesome stream anymore. That's horrible. Oh, it's... Damn it, that's the guy who's got the key. Hang on. Let's see if I can get him. Okay. This is one of your most top watch channels. Well, that's good. Band users can still watch but not engage. I suppose so. Hold up. Damn it. Bar's got in the way. do it. He's too slow. No. Damn it. 
that's unfortunate. Does he even know how to use that? Yes, he does. Well then, I'll have to deal with him upstairs. If you're watching someone while you're banned by them, you must you that you must be a hate watcher. Or a very bad misunderstanding happens. Let me go. No no no. Okay, I got him. Excellent. Chad, I never quite understood hate watching someone. I don't mean, like, streams, either. I mean, like, just watching all their videos as they come out. Just so you can be mad about them. It's like, is there not something better to do? Excellent. Kick that. Got the gallery key. Now we can get out of here. This room is always annoying, but there was a few dynamite throwers, so it actually worked out well. I think usually I always have the guy in red anyway. This is the first time I may have seen him as a villager. Okay, chat, hardest puzzle coming up right now. One. Two. Three. Four. Oh, thank God I remembered. That could have been- that we could have been here all day figuring it out. Teddy Yay is your most used emote. We should always be posting a happy Teddy Ursa. It's a good way to break in- or sorry, a good way to enjoy the stream. Any chainsaws? No, we got dynamite. No problem. Let's just take him out. That dynamite will help. I appreciate that we just all agree that Teddy Ursa is just our mascot. Is that a chainsaw? Oh, it is. There's two. Okay, let's pick up some ammo. Uh, looks like I have a little too much here. Uh-oh. I've yeah, grabbed a little too much, yeah. Whatever. Better watch out for more of them. They're silent because the game can't load chainsaw sounds where there aren't a chainsaw enemies normally. Ooh. Didn't see you there. I've been jump-scared by a silent chainsaw earlier in this run. Looks like I got them all. I should go ahead and reload this. I gotta sell my excess handgun ammo to the merchant next time. I'm really glad I got a single case upgrade. You have no idea how far that's gonna take me. Now then... Let me get the yellow herb in here. Ooh. Yeah, let's get rid of the 10-pack. Nothing I can combine it with yet. Combine it with this. Oh, right. I always- I always never remember that you have to press the stupid button on the wall first. It's so silly. Yeah, deactivate it. Get that. Now I need to make the bridge appear. There's not much they can do. Excellent. It's usually supposed to be rocket launcher dudes, but now they're obviously not. 
Take the goat. And let's get the heck out of here. Oh, bugs? Are they already gonna be coming at me? Let's make a save. I haven't really had crashes happen with the rando as much as other streamers, luckily. I'm a goat. You remember that joke, huh? Everyone's just secretly hopping around like a goat. Wait, what? Uh-oh. They replaced the crows on the windowsill. Fantastic. Ow. Hang on, I want this. Oh, wait. Never mind. They're on the windowsill <laughs> replacing the crows. It looks so silly. Um... I'll hold up for a red. I'll just use this. Oh, great. They can go through the metal doors, so we gotta move quickly. Could get the broken butterfly from that, but it's whatever. Oh! Uh, you know what? Do this. They're coming! Let's go, go, go. Hang on, if I reset the room, I could break the barrels without them chasing me. Are these guys worth it? Hmm, they don't seem to have a lot of health. And these guys still drop the butterfly parts. They seem to be stuck over there. Hold up. Remember things like Orange Crush. Bro, y'all remember that joke and never let it die. <laughs> I made a joke once and I was gonna get by some Orange Crush and drink it and bam. Oopsie. At this point, I'm invested in taking them out. Oh. Let me heal. I don't think these guys are worth it. I'm gonna reload. There we go. The question now is, what's going to replace the dogs in there? I've never had chainsaws in the hedge maze, but that sounds really funny. Double chainsaw guy would be even funnier. Everybody look. Everybody look. Can he solve the maze? Probably very easily, yes. Actually, hang on. Just reload this. I mean, it shows shows you on the map how to get through it, basically. Like, the two little symbols there are where the, the, the pieces are. But no one ever uses the map button in the OG game. Ever. Some people probably do. Probably should just use it here, but I want the treasure that way. Gotta take the long way around because of the lock. Oh, the yellow's there. Hang on. Yellow is obviously good for the long run. Oh, I still need to reload this again, because I reset. Hmm. Yeah, I'll use some TMP. Oh, they're stuck in the cage. I can hear their little stun gun, but it's, or sorry, the stun rod, I should say.
Grab a little bit of this, a little bit of that. You ever been to hit ever been in a real hedge maze chat? Bleh. I think they'd be quite comfy. Dead end. How do you get through that part again? Hmm, now I kind of forget, don't I? Right, I gotta go over the little bridge that's there, don't I? Need to check because my brain forgets stuff. Because I'm so used to the remakes layout. First, let's grab the first aid. This is the first first aid spray I have found this entire run. Do you real y'all realize that? It's pretty wild. Hmm. Hmm, I could throw away a pack of the a pack of these. Oh well. First aid spray is important right now. I found more golden eggs than first aid. Do this. Put that there. And we're just gonna run over the little bridge so we can get to the thing. Yeah, the map doesn't tell you where the little bridges are. You have to actually look for that. There. That's not so hard. Still one treasure there. Oh, wait. That's the one for ammo. Who cares? Oh, that's the back, silly me. The exit's over here. Now, there should be a new merchant up ahead, too. Just get in here, skip the Ada cutscene, and we're good. Saving content. Please wait. They're still coming after me, aren't they? Hang on, before I pick that up then, let's go visit the merchant and see if he's selling something better. Maybe they'll despawn if I reload. Nope, they're still out there. Okay then, fair enough. I heard them open a door. Welcome. Got some rare. What are you Nothing buying? new to, uh, to buy, what but for tune-up we can... Oh, point one upgrade. Oh, Mr. Merchant, you shouldn't have. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Semi-auto is still... Okay, I can go capacity upgrade for this. The firepower at 8.2 is good, but... What are you first, selling? sell a few things. Is that all... <laughs> Thank you. Is that all, stranger? We got six of these. All... <laughs> oh, I got 12? Thank when did I get 12 all, of these? <laughs> Thank you. Oh, I don't remember picking up the lamp either. Gems, the luminous oh, pendant. What are you buying? TMP firepower can go up to 1.9. Oh my goodness gracious! You know what? Fine, merchant, take it. Take my money. <laughs> Thank you. Rip me off for all I care. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Do that too. Thank you. Don't have the broken butterfly. What are you selling? What are you buying? Does he have any new triple combos, though? Nope, sold out still. The black bass keeps slowly filling up. At, at least I can buy some full heals from him if I'm in a jam, but I don't need these. Come back anytime. Technically, my weapons did get upgrades, but not very good ones. They're coming. Whatever. Not even worth going to sell it. A little bit more money there, but we don't need more money at the moment. Or handgun. The 
dinner room. If I get locked in the cage with like 6,000 Krausers again, that wouldn't be very nice. Before that though, we can check out the treasure room for a little extra gold. Usually I skip it, but it could be useful now. You know what? Since I seem good for heals, I'm just gonna use this to get max health. So I'm gonna need extra rifle later. Don't need that. Should go back to the night room. Gotcha. I can't even carry this anymore. <sighs> I gotta use up some of this um, shotgun. I haven't been getting the best power upgrades for it, though. There's the cheese. Darn. I'm, I'm gonna regret this, but I'm just gonna use it. Carrying more stuff. I even gotta leave heals behind now. Ain't that silly. No, I need the TMP first. Ding ding. Splash. I love the little, like, splatter noise that makes. Such a good one. Oh no. How did I- How- I just asked you not to do this game. I asked so nicely too. Wait, I got hit in the middle of that. Damn it. So nicely, streamer asked. Why? What is with this room and like spawning 70 billion Krausers? I just don't get it. Why does this seem to happen so much? Can Krauser just only like spawn in such a limited amount of rooms or something? It seems that one can't even jump down here though at least. Maybe they have no health. They can't reach me here. Okay, they don't have a lot of health. I might be able to do this. Hold up. I'm safe in the middle. They can't actually reach me. This one's got more health. Do this. Okay. He's covering his face with his shield arm. I can't really shoot his face. That's kind of the point. There we go. At this angle, I can. Just enough of an angle to hit through the cage, too. Am 
Come on, lads. Step right up. Tag out. There's a bullet for everyone's face. Oh, I'm empty. Maybe there isn't a bullet. Okay, he left too. The other ones are stuck up there. They can't get down here. We should be safe now to leave. Where? Oh, they're up there. Okay. I thought they had gotten down here or something. Hold up, let's get the magnum ammo then. Bro. <laughs> so silly. I'll take that magnum for now. I can see their footsteps. They're above me, but the game is loading their footsteps down here. What do I hear? Snakes? In spiders. I've gotten chickens here before. This room seems to give me good luck when it comes to terrible spawns like that. Well, I guess this is free. You know what isn't free? The rocket launcher. I literally can't carry it. There is literally no way for me to carry that. Like, it, it's not happening. <laughs> Oh, it sucks, but I should have the firepower to just deal with everything anyway. I'd probably only use it on Salazar. And Salazar, I can kind of easily cheese with my current weapons. Who came in the room? Them. Yeah, I can't carry that. I can't even carry handgun ammo. That's how bad my inventory is now. Five. You know what? I'll get rid of the five shells. Always make sure you reload. There's a merchant over there, but I'm pretty sure the game doesn't spawn him in. I can't, like, carry anything over here at all. What's in there again? Yeah, a bunch of ammo and the rocket launcher. I can't even do it. I, I just have to leave it. The enemy just melted back here. What happens? Snakes. Even the merchant became a snake. See? He's got some fine wares for us. Oh, okay, we gotta do the Ashley part. Okay, Chief Mendez or... Garador's. I would love to see Garador's happen during the Ashley part. That'd be funny. Hmm. It's a good thing I've got some rifle, though. Oh, that's right. I didn't have rifle ammo the last time I did this part. Isn't that right? I'm gonna grab some cheese. Let's go ahead and do this. Oh, Ashley stops making noises. Don't worry, I'll help you. It's what I do. Stop screaming. You're being helped. You're welcome. Regular cultists. How much HP they got? What was it last time? I think I had no ammo left at what? Bro, your head is gone, but it's not. I had no ammo left for the rifle, and I had shield guys coming at her, and I had to, like, reload a few times to get it to work. Eight bullets should be enough for this. 
Oof, I gotta stretch a little bit. The door's locked. I can't open it. I kind of had to spend the ammo to get rid of um the Krausers because they were just causing trouble. Hang on. You know what we can do, actually? Where are they? Uh-oh. That is not what should be near Ashley. Oh, fantastic. We're out. Oh, fan great. That'll do. Um, nothing else to do here. Yeah, he's dead. Who's left? Oh! Hold up. Can you imagine if flash grenades hurt Ashley? That'd be rage inducing. Place your bets now. I don't think you can have Krauser in Ashley's section. If you could, that would literally break the game. I don't think it's possible. I see a knight armor, and I hear something already walking. I think it's Chief Mendez and the knight armor. Let's do it. Like, enemies that have, like, specific grab animations, I'm pretty sure cannot be randomized here. Like, if the bugs could grab Ashley, it would just crash the game. Yep, it's Chief Mendez. Why am I looking at my inventory for him? Frickin' Ashley. Bit of a problem here. Will this even work on you? No. Go, Ashley, go. Hmm. Hang on, I think I might be able to kill him specifically with the lanterns if I get him over. Wait, what? I got the dodge prompt as Ashley? That usually doesn't happen. No, he's still alive. Hang on, I hope this one's enough. Otherwise, I'll have to lure him into the other room. Yeah, he's fading. Okay. Rare Mendez death animation. Well, he can't get in. How's the rando going? Just fine. I had a couple of uh, problem rooms, but for the most part, it's I've had way more clippable moments for this professional mode run. I hope you're all doing great. At the time of streaming this, I should mention for YouTube, it's like uh, New Year's Eve, so... There we go. I'm sure a lot of y'all that regularly attend the stream got plans, but I like doing some... I like doing something special on New Year's for this. It's comfy. Oh, what am I doing? That's the one I already opened. I did one of these last year as well, so if you're watching the playlist in a marathon, you'll probably hear Happy New Year, like, multiple times. <laughs> that just means you get double New Year luck. So why not? Why be upset about that? Oh, hang on, what am I doing? Pick up the red herb and go in here. I don't think the knights up ahead can be randomized, because I seem to always get knights, so I assume that the game breaks if it tries to load any other enemies there. It's kind of a miracle you can... No, I'm not going to take that. Leon won't be able to carry it. Let me see. Huh? There's a round indentation there. Maybe I can use something. Take the green. 
Ashley's got a flashlight because she's super cool. Ashley truly is a PS2 horror game protagonist now. Did I do that right? Right now is where I go back and hit the thing. Welcome, cute kitty. Hope you're doing good. Perfect. By the way, I got distracted by uh, something in the rando earlier. I mentioned playing more multiplayer stuff. I don't want to do that with more y'all on the server if I can. Even if it's just like a Mario Kart night. Um, wait, so now I hit this. Or, wait. Oh, it doesn't even work now. Right. That's what you do. Silly me, forgot about that button. Woo! Just popping by to say Happy New Year, no problem. Okay, now it's good. Let's see why Ashley can't just climb over the bars, though. Oh, no, no, no. Open that up. Give me some of that cheese. Take the spine. Only Leon needs all the little gems he can get. Yeah, I still see night armor. I didn't see that many of them, though. Rearrange the pieces. Uh, button does it again. Oh, right, that one's the middle. Silly me. Just put the middle piece in place and then just uh, turn everything around like a circle. Everything's gonna be okay, chat. Look at that! I found a bagel! Ashley gets a good opportunity to grab some treasure during this part. Even if it's a little bit, it can go a long way for Leon if we have some bad rooms later. Looks like that's it. Time to get the hell out of here. They gotta close this to make sure you absolutely can't leave. This part always terrified me as a kid. You just hear the knights stomping towards you and you're like, oh my god, no. Definitely spooky for the time. You're fine, Ashley. Stand up. Wow. Push. There's the last one over there. The knights do chase you all the way here if you let them. They take their sweet time getting to that spot. Oh, Mendez respawned. Well then, let's get out of here before he gets me then. I don't think he can actually walk over here. We're fine. Yay! Secret ladder. The butler has some pretty ass headquarters here, huh? Turn around and you get some free gold. Who's lighting all these candles up here? He knows where I am and he's trying to swing at me through the walls. He's not gonna get me though. Okay, we're done with Ashley's part. Now we get to go to the fun lava room that makes no sense. Yeah, down drink. Thanks, Ashley. Should be okay. I got no rifle. Now's the time to actually search these pots, because I didn't have inventory space before. Oh, darn. 
It's handgun. Luis is just chilling there. Don't worry about him. He's gonna be okay. Probably. It's not my problem. My job is to save the president's daughter, not him. Only thing I got is shotgun now. I'll take a blueberry, because clearly I'm gonna need one of those. Okay, that's where Ashley came from. I always get confused as to where to go at this particular spot. I need to go down the little long hallway. Lava room time. The lava room is actually really easy. There aren't that many enemy spawns, so even if they get replaced with something, it's usually pretty simple to just deal with them and be done with it. Wait here. I would not want to stand on that. Never would. Whoever made this funky contraption can just, like, nah. I got no TMP. Broke the chains and it falls into the squishy juice. Get free treasure. I don't know if the enemies can be random here. Perfect. Oh boy. Going to make hot chocolate? Sounds comfy. Alright, you'll be back later. If we're still going, probably. These runs usually go for like five, six hours. Prob I want to assume longer because I'm playing on pro mode. Of course, I edit out all the bathroom breaks for YouTube. Okay, you're not random. Or actually, you are. Yeah, you're definitely random. Oh, shield guy. Probably shouldn't have used all that rifle on him. Should actually use the riot gun like I keep saying I will. Ooh, pendant. Does lava actually glow? I don't actually know. I imagine, like, you know really hot like fire, so probably it could, but maybe video games have lied to me. I mean, if lava's melted rocks, that doesn't necessarily mean it would glow, right? Any lava experts in chat? Lava does glow IRL. It's really hot. Okay. You never know if it's one of those things that media has just kind of lied to you about. I can't believe Resident Evil 4 would lie about, like, stuff. Can you believe it? Whoa! Pretty damn rude, guys. He threw that thing at me. Let's get it. Molten glass definitely gl uh, glows. If it was glowing in this room, it'd be hot enough that you'd just be dead. Okay. Yeah, the heat would be unbearable in this room for sure, right? Like, you could... Is it... Could a room like this be so hot you couldn't even, like, breathe? I don't know the specifics. I don't plan on testing it. No idea. Well, now I have to take you out. You're just pissing me off. It's one of those things where, um, have, have you guys ever heard about this? Do you know that, like, most people, when they hear the sound of, um, horses, like, walking for the first time, they think it sounds weird. The reason for that is because back in the day, for movies, they would use, like, coconut, coconuts or something clonking together to, like, make up a sound for horses moving. And when they finally had the technology to have real horse sounds for movies... Um, people said that it sounded fake, so they just went back to using the coconuts, and that- and everyone just thinks that's what horses sound like. <laughs> what a funny story. Wait, follow me. Mm, I suppose I could just burn this. I have been getting a lot of, like, health upgrades this run. I can't complain about that. 
It's basically like a bit in Monty Python. Wait, do you mean the whole uh, thing is a bit? Or they're making fun of that fact or something? Let me see. Mm, yeah, this is fine. Let's go for a ride. I would die in the lava room. I wouldn't dive in the lava pool. I'm pretty sure I'd die. I don't need to test that to be sure. Take some of this, some of that. And now we can use this. Beautiful decoration. Only artists need more appreciation. Yes, they do. You think the movie industry appreciates anyone? Except the... Like, the two celebrities on the cover that get paid a billion dollars for everything they do? Monty Python has a knight, followed by a squire who clops coconuts together as they pretend to ride horses. Oh, I think I know what you're talking about, yeah. <laughs> That's funny. Let's go get the extra gold up here before we move on. I've been able to hoard some good treasure. I, When it comes to RE4 randos, I it definitely feels like the, um, the beginning is the most difficult part by far. Yeah, I can just ditch these. Remove this pitcher for some cheese. Anything else here? No, it's just to show you that there was a thing on the wall. But I got that way earlier because I'm a smart cookie. Anything to break? No, it looks like we got it. I hope we're almost to the part where Ashley gets lost. Don't like babysitting Ashley. Look at that castle.jpg in the background. Love it. Eh, can't take that. Saving that three magnum ammo can't make me throw it away. Too valuable. I'm gonna hoard it for the whole game and never use it. That's how you play video games. Okay, we're at the part where we have to get the two cups. Before that, we're gonna hop in here. I think I remember in this hallway, I've gotten Iron Maidens. Yeah, I got an Iron Maiden with a bunch of Krauser bombs last time. That was funny. Because it meant I couldn't run around it, I had to fire at it. I'm begging you for a case upgrade. Got some rare nope. Things on what are you buying? Maybe I want to see if he restocked the health upgrade though. Nope. What are you buying? <sighs> Reload speed. Rifle. 8.6. Take it. Take it. Thank you. The last. The last um, upgrade for reload speed makes it lower, so yeah, we don't even need to bother with that. Whoa! 1.0! My man actually gave me something good. You know, I could go for the exclusive. Uh, I think the TMP exclusive gives you, like, more firepower. Hmm. Not enough cash. Sell some goodies first. Got nine of these bad boys now. Thank you. There it should be good. Capacity to one fifty is pretty good. Thank you. Don't need to do that. Riot gun here. Hmm. That should be good. What are you buying? I don't really need to buy any health items from him, actually. Should be safe to sell. What are pitas? They're the currency in this game. That was there. I can't carry it. Here's my sign to start 
unloading with the shotgun a bit more. Oh, I forgot about this picture. Look at this one. Like, it looks like someone photo badly photoshopped a face onto, like, the tallest head ever. This one is so weird. Doesn't really stick out in the OG one. Setas, that's what it stands for. Okay. Itas. Take that. And that. Thanks for the information we talk about. We can't give you information. Chat, when someone asks a question, we all need to be condescending and rude about it for not knowing. We all doing being nice and wholesome. This is a stream. Not a charity. Oh, hey, how's it going? And there's dogs, too. Oh! Suddenly surprised, Ashley! <laughs> Did you see that? I raised the shotgun and Ashley just stands up being like, Hey, Leon, what's going on? <laughs> Why was she there? I was backing up. That's unfortunate and annoying. Wait. Okay, I know I can just leave Ashley behind, though. If I can run by this group at the very end, I should be okay. This is a pretty crappy room for this seed, but we'll deal. Four dogs. Where'd he go? Die. Oh, nice. Blueberry number one. Reload the shotgun when we got a second. Ten shells on that drop. Nice. Okay, let's get them with this while we have a second. I'm surprised I didn't get hit by that. That's a kind of a miracle. This would be a good time to use the lime as well. Oh, I hit one of the dogs back there. Heal, gotta heal. Okay, all three have their heads popped off. Let's do this. Okay. We gotta make a beeline for it. We can do it, everybody. I'm actually doing it. I'm actually doing it. <sighs> I can't believe that worked. That was extremely silly. Leaving Ashley at the door just actually somehow was safe for her. Oh, that's where this is. Oh, is that item still on the ground? It is. I guess I have room to pick these up and sell them later. That plan had no right to work. I know, right? Hang on, let's take a look at Jay Leno again. <laughs> that face is, is so badly photoshopped on. You can see the blur around it. Oh, boy. I was half expecting Ashley to just get killed by a dog and during all that. Yeah, fair enough. Welcome. 
I'm one smart cookie, though, for letting that work. Let's go get the other one. The next one's easier to do, though. Wait. That's the fun part of randomizers, though. Even if it can be a little janky sometimes, um, it is really funny when you figure out stuff like that. Especially, I mean, the game... The game had the issue with the them walking through the walls. I don't know why, but it's only that room. Enemies can just walk through the walls there when they're randomized. It's it's like they didn't program it. I To be fair, enemies aren't normally supposed to be in that hallway. They only show up in the arena. But, you know. Let's put this on. Hang on, is this reloaded? Yeah, I used up a lot of shoddy there, finally. Oh, right. That one auto-skips the cutscene for some reason. I think it's because it breaks in the rando. Also, doesn't seem to load in the music. This room is one of the reasons knife-only, or true knife-only, isn't exactly possible in this game. I don't think it's possible to knife those. Hmm? Island boys. Hey, Ashley, come on. You're safe. Come on. They weren't piloting that thing this time. And make collision for a hallway enemies aren't supposed to be in, yeah. Leon can't walk through that wall. That'd be silly. Chessboard. With only two pieces, too. What a lame board. Oh, right. Okay. What spawns we get? Oh, they're already coming. Yeah, this was the- oh, they got chickens back there. This is the one where I had an Iron Maiden with a bunch of, um... Krauser bombs. Let's get some extra goodies, because we like goodies. We like treats. Ooh, another green gem. Chickens. Made sure I picked up everything correct. This ain't the window I can go out of. Okay, we're almost to the bug room. This hallway here is just a chance to, like, get some more loot. I actually have space right now because I fired a bunch of ammo in the- in the night room. Come here. Just use it to restore the tiny amount of health I lost. My chest sets have more than two pieces? Of course they do. Of course they do. Excellent. I have one of those hardcore chess pieces where it comes with one pawn for one side and like uh, 10 billion knights for the other one. It's hardcore mode. I'm pretty sure that's not possible, right? Like, even the most genius big brain chess player could not just like have only one pawn against a full team of everything else. Then again, chess doesn't exactly have alternate rules, though. There we go. You want alternate chess? Just play a strategy RPG. I'm not gonna hop down that way, because I don't think it does anything. I probably should have just hopped down over there, but it's whatever. Picked up everything. There are plenty of chess variants. Oh, okay. Okay. 
Oh, hey, floating chainsaw guys. That's what I wanted. They got no health at least. No problem. Ooh, Magnum. That's pretty sick. Shogi has alternate rules and all that stuff. Okay. Get beamed. Beamed in the knees. Give me that. In reality, it just takes one dagger to the king's back by a servant to win a war. Excellent. Imagine if, like, that's like playing chess with, like, your cousin that makes up a bunch of stuff. I, I activate my pawn's special ability. He teleports behind your king. Checkmate. Nothing personnel, king. And then, bam, you win. Actually, this is a good chance to spend my shoddy here. Let's down my drink here. That sounds like it would be a funny idea for an indie game. It's called Unfair Chess. And you have to play chess against multiple opponents that just have, like, ridiculous rules for you to keep in mind. I activate mind control and suddenly your pawn in the back turns into uh, their, their, their pawn. You have to play chess, but your opponent's playing D&D. Excellent. Hmm. A game called Unfair Chess exists, I swear. Maybe. Sounds like something that would already exist. It's a lever for the bridge. And there's loads of little games based on chess with a twist. There we go. I should do a quick check of my butterfly lamps so I don't forget. I got one blue. Put it with that. Make RBY. Or sorry, RBG. RBY is Pokemon. What am I saying? Oopsie. A lot of decent treasures there. I missed the elegant head mask at the beginning because there was a bunch of enemies in that room. So I didn't get the first one. That's the second one right there. Okay, I got three TMP bullets in a dream. Well, I actually have loads of shotgun on backup, so I can't complain. Please, Welcome. have more stuff. I want stuff. Stuff is good. What are you buying? Ooh, 5.1, I'll take it. <laughs> Not you. taking this until the very end, just... I mean, at the very end, even if it does lower the reload speed, the, the firepower increase would help me with endgame bosses. Nope. Nope. Ugh, that was the only one worth it. Buying? can see if he restocked the full heal, or the upgrade. Nope. No reason to sell anything yet, then. Hmm. There's a game called Really Bad Chess where all your pieces are random. There's a chess randomizer. I honestly I should not even be surprised. Like you could play that at home. That sounds like it'd be very funny. It's an Android app. Doesn't shock me. Oh right, the crash room. Enemies can't be randomized here because game crashes. I think that cutscene also can crash the game, so it's important to skip it, even though I'm skipping them all. I don't know how to even really play normal chess, so I couldn't really do a chess rando.
Out of the way, Chucky. I'm gonna just pick these up. Yeah, I'll take some rifle. There's no reason to even shoot at those guys, though. Pop that right away. You've already lost if you don't have a king piece, that's right. What if you have multiple kings? Does that mean you have to get them all? Or is getting one king get you the victory? Excellent. Want more strategy games, though? Just play... Well, any kind of tabletop board game. I did say I wanted to play more of those, didn't I? I mentioned playing more trading card stuff. Once the new PC is fully ready, I was going to, like, get into Master Duel this year. I wanted to play some more of that because I got some friends that are into that, and my brother Andrew as well. So he definitely wants me to get more into modern Yu-Gi-Oh! so I can play with him. We might even be able to do a few streams out of it. Let me see. Nope, don't need to read that. Oh, I missed... I didn't shoot the last one. I was absent-minded about it. Was it at the bottom? Oh, I see it right there. It's behind the bar. Yeah, it's the top one I didn't get. Excellent. I'm gonna guess I got chickens again. It's really funny when you go down here and there's just chickens waiting for you. I don't hear anybody, so it could be. Gonna go ahead and run. Oh, it's bear traps. I hate these things. If it could fit as an emote, we should have an emote of Teddy getting hit by a bear trap. They're terrible. There's no bears in this game. Chickens! I was right. I was right. That's right, you hand it over. Hand over the goods. Dude, put this back. I don't want it. Not the teddy. I know. Teddy Urs is wandering into bear traps. I mean, that would be like a scary BRB screen. I imagine it's just like uh, Teddy Ursa wearing Leon's jacket and they're just surrounded by bear traps and it's like... <laughs> that'd be cute. Um, let's do this. I guess I'm mostly saving the Magnum for Salazar at this point. I did get chickens. I was right. Okay, shield bros. My rate of fire is pretty bad. So I have to wait a little few seconds to actually shoot him again. Oh, rocket launcher. Hmm. They're behind me. I'm gonna take him out for the hell of it. Uh-oh. That's pretty bad. You know what? It's lime time. Damn. I took out enough of them. I made my point. Okay. Garador is replaced with Island Boys. Ooh, I'm so scared. I don't think I've ever had anything cool replace the Garadors in this room. It's always just Weenie Hut Juniors over here. Damn, all I got's that, huh? Get them lined up. Boom! Shotgun to the face. Yeah, I'll take that.
Okay, the Garadorn replacements are down. You know what? I want to make some room. Still living? We can fix that. Well, this game doesn't have a tyrant, but lots of Resident Evil games don't have a tyrant. A tyrant was really more of a Raccoon City era thing. Excellent. Okay, we got all that. Kick it open. And a couple things to pick up. I have, I am swimming in treasure right now. I'm going to be able to get the exclusive upgrades for multiple weapons soon. No! Leon! Not Leon. Okay. Get the crown. Let's see what the striker replacement is. Hope it's something cool. Please have a ca case upgrade. I'm begging you. Welcome. Got some rare thing. What are you nope. buying? Wait, he what should have something buying? new here. This is where the striker shows up. Guess not. Guess it's after this, isn't it? What are you buying? The stock might be full. Hmm, two more capacity upgrades, one more firepower upgrade. Come back well, anytime. that was pretty useless. Oh, I should sell him the handgun ammo. What are you selling? Is that all? <laughs> and hang on, I should reload some of this stuff. I need to do that. I need to stretch a little bit, sorry. Mm. Sorry, I get so into the game sometime, I just forget to stretch. Reload that one bullet. I have one TMP on extra. Of course I do. Hmm. Alright, gamers. Let's go see who's replacing Vernugo. Will it be an invincible it? Probably. Okay, nothing else to pick up there. I can't carry... No, wait. I can carry the incinerary now. What am I doing? I just reloaded for that. Hydration station. Hmm. I might take another, uh, take a break and get another drink soon. I've gotten Double Chainsaw Boy in here before. I think Dylan has, too. I could play RE4 randos for, like, ever, man. Same with RE1. Same with Castlevania. But I do them, like, every once in a while. Don't want y'all to get too bored of it. But it's nice when I upload one of these and some people check out the playlist and they just marathon all of them that I've done so far. That's usually pretty fun. It's nice when new people discover the channel. The algorithm works sometimes. He's not actually here yet, but his tail should be. The actual enemy that replaces him will show up when we reach the end. Oh, I still have that out. Keyword sometimes. I heard from some people that the algorithm changed again. A lot of people are saying that suddenly subs aren't really getting notified of uploads. I noticed a bit of a downturn in some activity as well. I thought it's just because the games I'm playing, people aren't as interested, but... Sure, if I can blame the algorithm, I'll do that. Let's find out. Who is it? Oh, it's Mendez. Um, can I even kill him? I'm not convinced about that. You know what? Let's test it. I have Incendiary, so... Reload that one bullet.
Okay, I killed him. He's going into his fade out animation like with Ashley. Stare down. Yeah, that's what I thought. Oh! Wait. Oh! I thought he was only gonna replace the Verdugo that spawns in the room. Not for the entire chase part. Damn! I got lucky. That was free. That's the power of fire grenades against him. What series brings in the most new viewers? Um, it's usually when I do something Pokemon related, but Yu-Gi-Oh does pretty well too. Yu-Gi-Oh Tag Force 2 specifically is like at part 11, but like every episode still gets like 10k views on the VOD channel, which is pretty damn good, I have to say. Move this all the way. Excellent. Usually the algorithm loves Pokemon anything part one or a Pokemon one-off. Those usually do pretty well. Hmm. Wait, I just realized something. He didn't drop the crown jewel, right? I'm gonna need, I need to go back and check. I'm pretty sure it's because normally when Verdugo takes enough damage in that back room, it's when he le retreats into the vents and then you fight him for real outside here. And because I didn't kill him out here, that means he won't actually drop his treasure. No, it wasn't delayed. It's just not here. So I don't get the crown jewel. That's pretty lame. I mean, that's the trade-off for having a stupid easy fight down here. I can knock stuff over. I can't find it in the chest, no. This specific crown jewel is only dropped by Verdugo. Or Verdugo spawn. Well, we got by it quickly. That's good. Holy moly. Browser at the factory. Okay, underground bug cave. Let's do it. Camera took a second to catch up there. That's that's weird. I hope the merchant has something that's worth spending money on. Welcome. If the upgrades suck and I go for them anyway, I can always just uh ah there we go. I can always just save scum it by hitting retry. That's all he's got for me. A capacity upgrade for the riot gun. Let's ditch the handgun ammo on him then. What are you selling? Is that... <laughs> hmm. Rifle's mostly full. I got a heal right there. The magnum's slowly building up. We can use that. Hmm. Fully armored Garador in the mine. That's a new one. I can't creep by him because his friend in purple there is gonna cause a problem. So I'm probably better off getting a quick snipe shot in. Okay, good. He doesn't have enough health. Nice. The question is, is the Garador replacing the regular villager? Because that means there's going to be multiple of them up ahead. You're more cultists, so... Let me scope it out. Happy New Year in the UK. Everyone's having their New Year right now. That's awesome. I'm glad you're all enjoying the stream. Okay, it looks like the Garador is in the common spawn. chest there. Should be okay. I hope you're all doing excellent. You too, YouTube audience. 
YouTube audience is just as special as all of y all of you guys, unless they're rude. Uh oh, I hear him. Yeah, I see one. Let's see if I can get him right quick. Okay, he's creeping. Let's climb up. Nice, he had no health. Excellent. Suplex, baby. This type of room, especially since uh, scythe wielders can be in here, it's probably best to just pick them off. Some of them have low HP. Excellent. Oh, pardon me, my ear is itchy. You just take off my headphones and sort that. Wonder who's gonna replace Chainsaw Jimmy. Take that. Chance to reload while I have a second, so let me just do this. Excellent, excellent. Kick. Get kicked, get beamed. Perfect. Oh, someone just dropped behind me. You know what? I will take you out. The flail guys have an annoying amount of HP, and guess what? I don't like them right now, so let's do this. Hit in the butt. Ass cheeks of steel. And of course he went over the railing so I don't get his drop. This guy's looking at me funny. Finally. I think I hit him with the rifle quite a few times, didn't I? Uh. Oh. I didn't hit the first thing because it was so busy because of the Garador. I don't know about you, about you, but if I, my butt gets hit by a shotgun, that's pretty much it for me. Pull the lever. Who's gonna replace Chainsaw Man? Someone else is hopping down. I don't have to finish these guys off anymore. We took them out enough. Ashley can't even take an arrow. Nope, she can't. Oh, it's just a scythe guy? Well, that's pretty piss easy. Okay, he heard me talking crap. I hear a Garador in the background that spawned. Fantastic. Is there two? No. This is actually a bad spot to be in, not gonna lie. Oh. Oh. You know what happened, chat? You know what happened? The collision of those little, like, sandbags made me kind of veer to the side and walk right into them. <laughs> I was basically moving against the wall, and the wall was technically curved. Oh, I gotta restart that? Oh, piss off. Okay, then. That was really silly. I'm gonna run like heck. I took this room nice and slow, and guess what? Now I'm supersonic. Warp speed, everybody. Sorry. We told you people on the phone we don't want any. Okay, that was pretty rude. He hit me. Luckily, their damage output seems to suck. 
Pick up that gold. Use the iframes on the kick. Oh, that hit me. I will take the hit, because I can do this. It's been a long time since I got hit by the um, insta-kill from the Garador. Hello, friend. Happy New Year to you, too. I thought I was going to die, to be honest. I went for it. I got to hit the thing again. Hey, there's the second one. Okay, I think it's time I use a grenade. getting some distance. They're gonna corner and kill me if I don't do this now. Okay, I can do this. I can do this. Here's what we're gonna do. Here's what we're gonna do. Here's what we're gonna do. Can they just hop up ladders, or can they climb them at all? No, it seems let's do this. Oh, they can climb ladders, yep. It's hard to believe that, because there's no ladders in any rooms that they normally spawn in. Oh, great. behind me was he was probably the one at the start of the room i thought he, i assumed he would have followed me into the room so he was actually just standing there and i by shooting those guys i aggroed him again at the very least that tells me that if i run by these two they won't follow me into the room but i miss those barrels surprise Another clippable moment right there. I did not even know he was there. I got jump scared by that. Okay. I can't go fast. I'll be a little more patient this time, I swear. Oh, that's bad. That's bad. I said I'd be patient, but they're kind of in my way. No problem. Have I played Dead Space? Nah. I kind of... Well, that's not true, actually. I did play the first one, original first one a long, long time ago, but... I didn't play the remake, is what I mean. I kind of want to, but... The thing is, because EA owns the property, I don't really want to get invested in something that's probably just going to get cancelled again. I haven't bought an EA game in, like, an eternity. Excellent. Did 2 and 3 suck? I, well, I know that three really sucked. I, people did not like that one. I heard, like, uh, the devs were basically told to make a game that they did not want to make every step of the way. One and two are fantastic. Oops. I want to check that. Man, you are absolutely ruining my day, dude. Busting my chops right now. Let's 
get the stuff and move on. Big issue was they were pretty much mandated to make 3 a co-op shooter. They probably looked at, like, how well Resident Evil 5 sold and were like, do it, do it for Dead Space. Okay, we got that. Now another Garador will spawn as soon as I get the dynamite going. Okay, we're- oh, he's right there. Holy crap, two TMB bullets would have killed him? Oh, that upsets me even more. Uh-oh. Excellent. Perfect. I tell you, one remake that I am looking forward to next year is, um... The Clock Tower remake, or remaster. We're still not quite clear on what it actually is going to be. I feel like the marketing for that trailer could be a bit better. Okay, we got that. We got dynamite. Oops, what am I doing? I just put it in the dynamite hole. the velvet blue. Oh, the dynamite takes them out. Uh-oh. Five magnum right there. That's cool. Okay, we're finally... Oh, right. This room. I totally forgot this was here. Well then. Boss fight ahoy. After this room, I might take a little break just to eat a snack or something. I'm getting a little bit hungry. And you don't want to play through the entire second half of Resident Evil 4 while you're just sitting here hungry, you know what I mean? Let's take him out. I can't remember the rules for this being randomized. I think one has to always be... Uh, Nel Gigante. And it's JJ. Of course it's JJ. It's always JJ and one of these guys. Well then. Wait, his bullets actually hit him. Hold up. Let's do it. Damn, I was hoping his legs would be a shield for me. Damn it. I gotta restart. We need to get rid of him. JJ, I mean, he's in the way. Okay, there we go. That worked out pretty well, didn't it? That's that. Now stay away from this so he doesn't grab me. It's a sucky way to die. Oof. Mm. Let me just reload this first, actually. That would probably work better. That was a pretty clean run of that room, once I knew what I was dealing with. Oh, there's one left. Damn, that sucks. I'll do that. <laughs> I'd rather take the shot of here. I also could have just reloaded this first, but it's whatever. It's only one bullet taking up too much space. Yeah, okay, it's closed now. Good. We don't want to get accidentally grabbed by the fella in the lava. Blueberries. What's my health at? Full. Well, uh... Wait, why do I have handgun on me again? Damn it. I didn't sell those yet. Okay.
Okay. Clock Tower 1 is a cool game, but yeah, it's never been officially released in English. Everyone's only played the fan translation. Be nice to play the remaster for sure, yeah. Did they actually give a release date on that? I don't even remember. I'll just do this. Take the two. Now we're gonna go in here. Okay, funny bug room, but is it gonna be villagers? Loading guys with rocket launchers. Oh, that's great. That's really, really great. Floating guys with rocket launchers. That can just shoot me from literally anywhere. Floating guys with rocket launchers with too much health. Hmm. Let's pick them off the old fashioned way like I should have. Are their boots rocket propelled? No, they just don't like gravity. That's one of the side effects of Las Plagas, actually. Can't hold all this stuff, dude. I can't hold all the stuff. Let's just hop in here first. Find some goodies. This actually seems like it's pretty easy. Enemies aren't swarming me. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. He's holding dynamite and he can't run or move with it very well. Wait, did he? He dropped out of the thin air. Real tired of your crap, lads. Any more of you? Any more. These guys spawned in to float. Because I hit the switch. I think I got them all for now. Run over here for a second. Gravity's not keeping them down. Oh, I can't hold anything today, can I? Hang on, I know what to do. No handgun this run. Only TMP. Who that? I love dynamite. I love when it's useful like that. I'm carrying... Way too much handgun again. I want to sell this pack of 50 at least, though. Let me have that. Let me just have that. I swear it's important to me. Reload this, because the capacity is up to 150. I said I was going to get a snack soon, but I didn't do that. God, I'm so silly and quirky sometimes about that, aren't I? Hit both switches, so it should be okay. Time for the fun box. These caves are very noisy. For the people who may or may not get crushed in the middle of these. Yeah, I was making sure this wasn't the one with three of them. All oh, right. Hit the lever so you can stand in the middle. I'm always afraid because of the angle I'm going to get hit. 
Because you can easily get hit, because that camera angle sucks for that. No, I don't think I've ever checked. Is there just, like, a free gem to shoot down over here, or what? No, it doesn't look like it. I got one of the crown jewels, but I can't get the full thing. Okay, I reached the end of the chapter, and now we're going to the mines. The mines are a good opportunity to get funny randomizer results. Save successful. And there's a merchant. Okay, let me check the merchant before I take a quick snack break. I need to refill my drink and everything, too. Let's go case upgrade, please. Welcome. I'm tired of leaving everything behind. Got some rare. Nope. What are you I don't think he can even sell anything new anymore. He just never does. What about tune-ups? 9.2. Take that. Thank you. Capacity at 20. You. Capacity at 200. <laughs> Thank you. What All we're selling? really getting is uh, capacity exactly. upgrades, which is silly. Back, I've had no reason to sell all the spinals and stuff yet. What are you selling? Is that I'm determined to sell all the handgun ammo. It can't stop me. Happy New Year New Year from Poland. Hey, happy. How's it going, Bacon? Everybody's wishing the Happy New Year's today. Alrighty, I am back, everybody. I had a quick little break. I had some chocolate peanut butter cookies. They were very delicious. And let's continue. I am no longer on the road to being hangry at everything. Let's find out what we have over here. Oh. I thought that was a Garador for a second. I was about to say, not again. They're already aggroed towards me, so... It might be best to just kind of trip them up and run by. Taking these guys out isn't worth it. We can just kind of give them the slip. The Velvet Blue. I hope you're all doing well. You all seem to be celebrating. Oh! It's JJ! Come on, come on, come on. Can I do this? The wooden boards are protecting me. Excellent. Okay, we made it. I never had JJ there. That's interesting. The music says they already know I'm here, so who is it? Island boys. They're already all rushing at me. Jeez. I should probably just form a choke point in the hallway then. They don't have much health, it seems. Hmm. Why do I keep picking that up? I don't know either. Excellent. Anyone have any plans for what their first game of the new year is going to be? You see. I actually finished up playing a visual novel last night, so... My personal game time is kind of free for stuff. I know that I want to play a bunch of new games this year, for sure. Oops. Get kicked. Okay. Carefully. Another big goal of mine is to play more Mega Man this year. Um... Damn, I want this. Hold up. Of course, I have been playing a lot of Mega Man, but the issue is... Here we go. The issue is I didn't have a whole lot of time to work on the Mega Man videos over the year. I blame that on the injury still. But I'm going to get a lot more done this time. Actually, plan to do a whole bunch of script writing next week. I've never felt so motivated to do it, too. Ooh, this is nice. The 
chainsaw guys got replaced with some of these lads, so we're safe. Okay. Uh-oh. There goes one. Damn it. Oh, no. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Oh, I should have just used the heal. Stun rod dudes just stun lock you, unironically. Too many good games, not enough time. Heck yeah. I mentioned getting into Master Duel. Like, sometimes, I think last year I kind of told myself that I needed to only play games that could be, like, completed. Oh, jeez. There's nothing wrong with getting into an endless game, though, where you play until you get bored. Try out new multiplayer stuff. Let's do that. Damn it. Let's just climb up and get the thing, since who cares about the bottom? Take this. Um, I may as well use it now. Let's take the bottom as an exit this time. Nope. Give him a little trip. Excellent. I think because of that, like, mindset, um, when I was talking about a second ago, I only played a lot of short games in the past year, which isn't very fun sometimes. You gotta mix it up and just j do stuff. Okay, let's deal with this. I did also mention Baldur's Gate. I do want to beat that. I did kind of want to play Cyberpunk on my own as well. I like Cyberpunk stuff, and the game is fixed now, and I get it for a dirt cheap, like, sale price, then why the hell not? Okay. Take these and dodge the bros. Excellent. Reload this while we have a second. What about the other ones? Damn, they're all full, too. This is the spot where you want to unload all your shoddy, though. You look five more. Jump over. Oops. Held the button down a second too long. Can they even go over the carts? Yes, they can. Come on now. Nope, don't need these. You seem to be stuck right there. Let me just duck. There we go. Now let me get the lad behind me. Oh, he fell out. Okay, good. Let's reload this. Okay, let me fix my thing. I kind of wanted to also play more Souls-like in the next year as well. Oh, they're stuck. Still have yet to play Dark Souls 2 or 3 for the first time. I'm kind of in the middle of Elden Ring. I'm playing that passively with a friend when they're over. 
These guys are just bullet sponges. This part's annoying for, for them to be here. Okay. Oopsie. Wait for the dodge. Nope. I enjoyed Lies of P, yeah. I beat it on my own, and now I'm replaying it on stream already. It's good. Damn it. Lies of P was a game I just jumped into randomly for the hell of it. And I enjoyed all of it. Okay. Jump, Leon, jump. Come on. Okay. Now let me reload this. How much shotgun did I spend in all that? The answer was yes, all of it. There's the lion. I sacrifice the lion, I mean. You have to put it in the lion's mouth above ground. Let's do it. I'm just running for it. Screw it. Go, 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 go. No! I almost had it. <laughs> and I fell into the floor. Hang on, I'll just take out the Magnum and stun him. Or better yet. That's probably an easier solution. I don't know why I didn't do that sooner. Yes. Later, chumps. Okay, now we're at the Captain Crunch statue. Not bad. Look at us go. Excellent. I think another thing I definitely want to play a lot of, um, aside from more multiplayer games, which I already mentioned, um, maybe some more super long RPGs, because those are the type of games I can't really stream. Let me see here. And they're just the type of thing I enjoy vibing with on my own, but I always tell myself I have no time, and then I never play them, and then they pile up for, like, years. Like the 100 to 200 hour RPGs. Maybe it's time I finally get through every Disgaea game. Fall down, Leon. It's fun. Oh, right. I have to, like, walk away from the statue. I never remember to do that. Okay, they have moderate HP. Where you going, bro? Also, some chickens seem to spawn in. Maybe I'll beat a Final Fantasy for the first time this year, yeah. I did always want to beat, like, 7 and 8. The original ones, of course. Well, 8 doesn't have a remake, but you know what I mean. Hey! Really? Really? That was exciting. That was unfortunate. Just operate that. That dude's having a little freak out over there. I don't think he's gonna be okay. Let's do it. To this. Pop up onto that. Oh, hey, gold egg. Finding lots of gold eggs today.
900 casetas. Uh oh. At least they don't have that much health. Hmm. Do I have any? No, I don't. No extra bullets. Now I need to hop down there so I can hop down to that. What's that guy doing? Is he stuck? Another egg. Don't mind if I do. Hmm. Okay, there we go. There are still plenty of PS1, PS2 games I missed out on as well. I want to play them. For sure. I picked up all the treasure I really need. Let's just go. Oh no! He's coming! Kick it and run. <laughs> this part is so stupid. So wild it's even in the game. Yeah, 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 get me out of here. Leon's funky arm textures are back. Now let's do everyone's favorite part, the clock tower climb. This is the last part of the castle, and then we fight the boss. What am I looking at for ammo? I'm kind of hurting for it now, aren't I? Okay, that's fine. We will be perfectly fine here. Ugh, pardon me. Need to fix my thing. Excellent. I think more of us, we should just try more random games on Steam. I've done that a few times and I end up discovering stuff I really like. Is it coming down yet? Oh, rocket launcher, boys. That's annoying. Uh-oh. Well, that's a problem now. Use this. Okay, perfect. Take the shoddy, take that. Let me reload it. Don't really have much in the backup, or sorry, much in the way of backup TMP. Let's just climb. I don't think the dynamite guys actually know how to pull the lever. Those guys are running for it. So we can just kind of run for it. It's pretty good. That hit them, but there's no reason to go down and get their loot. Um... Okay, yeah, this room confuses me sometimes. Dynamite. Fantastic. Uh-oh. So much inventory Tetris happened in this run. Uh-oh. No, no. Mm. No! That flipped me. I thought it was... I thought I was stuck between the boxes for a second. I, th I genuinely thought it was over. Damn it. You're pissing me off up there, buddy. Okay, we'll take that. Oh, boy. Reload this, get us back to 100. Oh, no. No, 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 no. Are they throwing them onto this? No! Dude, where even is he? They're in front of me. All I have is the gold chicken egg. Pfft, 
caught that one in the nick of time. Dynamite tossers here would really, really suck. Uh oh. Okay, good. I was worried about that for a second. This is really nerve wracking. Oh boy. At least I got an extra green herb. I needed that. I was spending all my shotgun just to get through this part. Because if I die and have to restart it, I'm going to lose my mind. No, 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 no. No, no, no. Okay, we're good. We're good. Dude, where are they? Okay, now we're safe. There's nowhere else they can spawn in from. We're good. Holy moly. Excellent, excellent, excellent. You know, not just games on Steam I also need to play. Like, looking over at my shelf, I have a lot of stuff that's still, like, uh, for, like, PS4, Switch, even a lot of 3DS RPGs I haven't really gotten to play. Some of them I will try to do on stream, like, uh, still, still hopeful for Fire Emblem if I can. Do that. Never underestimate how good it can be to just have, like, a massive RPG to play every night until you're done with it. It's good to just turn something on and vibe with it. You don't need to be the best at it. You don't need to be number one. You don't even need to be number two. As long as you're number one in your heart, having a good time, or something sappy like that. Hmm. Okay, I picked up the bangle. My tiny machine pistol is doing perfectly fine. Oh, I just realized something. I remembered. Um, the merchant's replaced by an enemy here, so I don't get to prepare, right? Yeah. Ooh. Throw away the handgun ammo. Make a save. Taking a look at this. All right, let's get ready to pulp Salazar. Here he comes. Wow, that went pretty well. Okay, let's finish it with the Magnum. No problem. Wow, that was really piss easy. He, like, couldn't do anything to me. Seems like his health made him a bit of a bullet sponge, but whatever. That's pretty good. Perfect. Well, that's, that's the thing, um, Nameless. Um, I know whenever I mention that I want to play Fire Emblem Fates, people tell me it sucks over and over, and I can't avoid that, but I still want to play it anyway. I want to play things for myself, not because, like, other people say they're good or not. I could wait a second to see if I can upgrade the capacity of, um, this over here. Okay. Oh, yeah, I know about Zelda Minish Cap. I do want to actually... Oh! That's a chainsaw, Ganado. Hold up. Right. 
Bro, why are there freaking chainsaw ganados down there? Got them in the boop them in the butt right there. Oh boy. Yeah, let's have a look over here. Excellent. Take that. I uh, should probably just reload the rifle and make room for that. Take a blueberry. Remember in the days I actually needed to come down here for ammo. What am I doing? Not anymore. Let me get that treasure. I'm just going to move on. It's island time next, everybody. Um... That doesn't work. So I'll just take and use it. Reload with the magnum, because I might be able to get more cheese shots out of it. Whatever. You know what? I'll just throw away one of these. So I can reload this immediately have the space. Excellent. Chat, you ever feel like you've played a game, you enjoy the heck out of it, and then you find out that, like, literally nobody has ever played it? Let me see. I feel like that sometimes. I just waste a bunch of money right there if I do that, so let's not do that. Mr. Merchant, I've come back. I need your help. Got some rare. What are you selling? First, let me sell things. Is that all, stranger? Is that all? <laughs> Is that all? <laughs> Thank you. Sell the RGB one. Thank you. The one with the GP, because we can't get the third now. <laughs> yeah, there we go. What are you buying? <laughs> mm. How much will this take it from what 9.0? Just a bit short. Hang on. These and treasures. Can't get any more butterfly lamp stuff. What are you buying? What are you buying? What are you selling? Let me see. Ah. <laughs> what are you buying? Is that all? <laughs> 9.7 for that. Yeah, that's fine. This thing's a killing machine now. Not enough cash. So we'll upgrade that stuff later. What are you Hold buying? Up. I think I've been looking at this. Let's see. Am I losing my mind, or did, like, it change? Have I, I think I've just been looking at the reloading speed the wrong way the whole time. I think it's actually been improving it, but, um, I thought it was randomized that it actually was increasing it sometimes. <laughs> Oops. That's fine. Honestly, upgrading reload speed is pretty worthless in a rando anyway. Hey, you know what that means? I just got more engagement in the comments correcting me. That's even better. What am I worried about? Nobody ever misses an opportunity to tell someone they're wrong about something. Take this. Why can't I carry all these items? Be oh, right, because Mr. Fancy Pants won't sell me a new suitcase. That's why. Alrighty, let's do it. Now it's time for the island. This one is actually going quite fast, it feels like, anyway. Or maybe it's because I had a good snack and everything before I started streaming. So I don't feel like I'm in a rush to beat the game. You always miss the chance to tell people they're wrong. Don't worry, you can tell me I'm wrong about something, too. Chad, I made a mistake on the internet. Do you think that means I should delete my channels? This is very serious business now. We're talking real, real serious stuff. No bears this time. You can't even meme about that. Apology video first. Okay, does anyone know where the nearest instrument store is? I'll check whatever's in the clearance bin. 
let's hop down and get this. One forty minutes from your place, you'll drive me? Okay. I hope to God there's a saxophone left. Excellent. No one heard that. Ooh, got crusty for a moment. Wow, that dude can carry her without his arms being gone. Wait, he ran towards me while carrying her. I is he still there? That'd be so funny. Nope, can't do that there. Get beamed. Also, welcome back, Captain. How you doing? Let me see. I mean, we j listen, chat, we joke about it. People will get... This is YouTube and Twitch. People have gotten mean over a lot less. Excellent. Let's take him out. Damn. 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 Where did he come from? Y'all just want to get in my way right now, and that's pretty rude. Oh, I killed the JJ replacement. His name really is JJ, by the way. You can see it even in RE4 Remake when you get his charm. Because the, the charms in RE4 Remake are based on the models of the OG game, which is cute. Oops. Excellent. Okay, they're all out of the way. We can do the piss-easy laser puzzle in peace. Hmm. I'll just use this. I need to check the door first before it turns on. Those guys were very much in the way, so we wanted to deal with them first before we do this. Let's climb up. Oh, don't worry. I know about Yu-Gi-Oh. If I'm gonna play- if I'm gonna play competitive Master Duel, I'll- I know I gotta run them damn staples. I know how it goes. Let's see here. Firstly, though, how I'm probably going to play Yu-Gi-Oh! online is I'm going to make a Chain Energy Burn deck that's going to be consistent 1% of the time, and I'm going to play it 100 times. And I will enjoy the one time that it works out of those, because that's just how I am. I want to watch the world burn every once in a while. What am I doing? The ladder's over there. I'm getting confused. If you play Exodia enough times, you'll you'll get the turn zero win. And then that's all you need. Ooh, nice. I'll just throw this one away. Who cares? Be sure to only upload that one game. Yes. I mean, of course, I only upload the good attempts. That's why every... That's why this playthrough is labeled damageless on YouTube, because I edited out all the deaths. YouTube will never know that I actually died a bunch of times. Okay. What? What poll? What did you make? What did you do, Lorelai? I'm getting concerned. Whoop. How many subs you need to give me to play Hearthstone? I don't... I have never been attached to any Blizzard-related property or care about them, so I, I don't have any interest in Hearthstone. You made a poll over who the cutest Pokemon is? You put bunnies and Kleppa on there. Excellent. 
that's to show you where the emerald is. What, what Pokemon you'd spend New Year's with. Ah, uh, okay. How many subs do you need to give to make me play Raid Shadow Legends? Um... Bro, I've gone ironically gotten the money offers to play that for real. Let me tell you, they they don't give that much. Or rather, they get, they offer you very little because they think you're stupid and don't know how advertising works. Okay, we're gonna run over here, pick up this. Let's go ahead and reload some stuff. He dropped his rocket launcher. Poor baby. That's just handgun. We'll hit this over here. get the links we'll see the problem with like getting a lot of those like raid shadow legends things especially if it's it's for a stream the only way they're gonna actually like pay you good for it is if you get enough people uh that sign up with your code to specifically download and get to a specific level so, the only way for a streamer to succeed with one of those, at least a smaller streamer anyway, is you have to basically beg your audience to download the game and play with you as you're doing it. And, like, I'm sorry, like, I could not even pretend to give that much of a crap. It sounds like a pyramid scheme. Oh, yeah, probably is, kind of. Hello, Mr. Merchant. Got any good stuff for me today? Uh, okay. What are you buying? Oh, all this time waiting, and it's just an incendiary grenade is the next thing. Oh, he's got new two of these available. Well, I'm actually already close to the full, so I don't need it what anymore. <laughs> Take this. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Not, not enough cash. Come back anytime. No problem. No problem. Yeah, I absolutely misread the reload speed thing. I'm kind of a little embarrassed by that. That's okay. Oh, hey, look, I did that. Why is no one voting for Teddy Ursa in the cute Pokemon poll? Do y'all want to get banned? Oh, no. Oh, no. I'm prepared for this. I'm prepared for this. There's multiple. Okay, one of them had, like, no health. Why did Cleffa just win the entire frickin'... <laughs> the entire frickin' poll? Y'all want me to ban you. That's what you want. That's the first time we actually got Double Chainsaw Boy, too. The vote was rigged. Yes, it was. Bobby Pen. What is Bobby, and what's that about his pen? But it looks like it says something else, actually. Now that I take a closer look. This is a great military facility. I love how useful it is for everyone here. We'll take this. Man, it's dirty. Ah! Bro, I don't see these guys the whole freaking playthrough. Oh. I don't see them the whole playthrough, and all of a sudden, they're just, like, two rooms in a row. It's kind of unfortunate. I was hoping we'd see them early on, because they're harder to deal with, but at this point, I can just save a magnum for them, right? 
One of the Lynx statues, or sorry, the Lynx gems. What? Oh no. <laughs> He's got two chainsaws strapped together with chains. I forgot that more enemies spawn when you go downstairs. Okay, no problem. Future me, edit that out so the YouTube audience thinks I'm perfect. Oh. Okay. Let's use up some of the grenades. As soon as I go downstairs, there's gonna be another one. Um, prepare grenades. Walk to the table. Come on. Oh no, he didn't stun that one! <laughs> okay, I, that startled me. Oh, man. Well, yeah, normally it's just like some rooms it can only randomize into one specific enemy, right? Because only one specific enemy type can like spawn in, if that makes sense. Ooh. Someone should make a mod that replaces every enemy with just the chainsaw guy, the double chainsaw guy, that is. Actually, you know what? The randomizer makers should just make an option to make, you know, a chaotic mode like that, yeah. The RE1 remake randomizer has an option to make many tyrants spawn. The reason it's many instead of all is because the tyrant breaks multiple rooms, so we can't spawn in all of them. Okay, let's go get Ashley. Turn around and open this up. The cutscene makes you almost miss that. Who is it? They were shuffling. RE4 pain mod. Chat would love to see me play a pain mod. They want to see streamer get mad and curse and hoot. Some rare things on what are you buying? Killer seven? Oh finally. Hang on. What's capacity at? Seven. Um What are you selling? Is that wait to upgrade capacity what then? But everything else. TMP. <laughs> Thank you. Firepower upgrade. We want that one more what for the TMP selling? first. So let's sell some stuff. Is that... <laughs> Thank you. These are worthless now. No more lamps. Is that... <laughs> ah. <laughs> Thank you. I'm not even close to getting the exclusive now. So let's wait for it. Got him. Is that it? Get beans. I think I'll just use up a blueberry. Okay, that's all of them. Open that up. Someone say beans? Yes, I just did. I did say beans. And who's gonna replace the regenerators in this hall when I leave? Everything's gonna be just fine, don't worry. Is 
some kind of research equipment. Locked. Okay. Blue. Green. There you go. Easy. Luis Memo, blah, blah, blah. We don't need to hear your mo hear about anything, Luis. For that, I can leave now. Stop me. Oh, I took a screenshot. I forgot Xbox controllers have that feature. Okay, if I time my knife, There, see? All I had to do was just hit the knife at the right time. Now we're gonna go reset the room. So I can get a new checkpoint. Hey look, Magnum ammo. That was, see, you see what I mean about some rooms being crusty because of stuff like this? Obviously you're not, the game is not programmed normally to account for two Krausers at the same time. So, that's why sometimes it seems like the QT just doesn't work and I'm just dying for it. And again, you also can't shoot if the X button is demanded of it, which is st silly. Okay, we got the freezer key. Oh! Here we go again. Okay, I got him. <laughs> Fun game, right? Fun game. What else to get here? Completely frozen and won't open. Let's open this up. The infrared scope. Oh man, should I take this? Might be a problem later if I need it, so... Here's what I'll do. Let me reload up my weapons first. No, Sadler can't really be randomized. His fight is too unique for that. Hmm. Um, okay, that's full. Need to make room in general anyway, so we'll just do this. This was supposed to be Krauser, but he already spawned in alive, so... The cutscene has nothing to focus on, which is funny. And now it remembered that he's dead. And I already got the key card. That goes to that there. So now we need to head back down here. Wasn't it? Like, I need to go to the waste disposal thing. Good God, where was that? It was upstairs. What am I doing? That's operating room. Where the heck am I looking right now? I think I need to go down the side. No, that's the wrong way. Yeah, that's the one. Over here. I thought that's where the operating room was before. That's why I didn't go back that way. Take the TMP ammo. Take a free grenade. Or not, apparently. I'm gonna be silly and drop that away. How many times did Krauser clone himself? The answer is too many.
Lamau got him. No reason to even use it. Wonder if we're gonna see more chainsaw boys soon. Need this. Now this will work just fine. I guess I can afford to hold the blueberry. Don't worry, I'm on it. You can always trust good old Leon to help you out. Oh. Oh, the two best guards on the island, everybody. Garador and a bear trap. Let's take out the ace first. Okay, now let's focus on the Goomba. We got luck. We got a lucky crit. Got a lot of HP, apparently. Just in time. You can't hurt any bears ever again. Who's down here? I don't usually see Garadors on the island. Now, this is a fun one. I love when the enemies just all pile in together. I think there's a yellow downstairs, right? Leon, help. Help me, Leon. Oh my god, could you just help me already? Ashley needs to chill out a little bit. I will just do this. And I shall not care. Here's the wacky little storage room where you go to save. Who works at this desk? Why do they work there? Ban Ashley, she's she's backseating. She would, wouldn't she? I feel like the president's daughter would backseat. Okay, who's replacing Iron Maiden? A regular dude. I've had double chainsaw boy and everything, but no, this is just pitiful. Oh, is he dead? Oh, no. Now he is. Oh, right. Going backwards is just how you reach the, um... It's just how you reach the the tower that with no purpose. We don't need to bother with that. Nah, don't worry with this. Whatever they're growing, it looks very gross. Oh, can't carry anything. You know what? I may as well do this. Shoot the little flammable thing to get some funny results. Oh, come on, lads. I have one case upgrade, and I'm making the most of it. I don't think I'm getting another one. Let's go back to Ashley. We got what we need. Respond in. Is it Chainsaw Jones? Ah, it's two Chainsaw Jones. Oh, boy. Somehow this run has some of the most double chainsaws guys ever, and they're all just like back to back shoved at the end. To be fair, I often do complain that um, the island doesn't have much variety in when I do randomizers. I usually get island boys anyway.
Okay, chapter complete. Okay, next is the funny construction device that Ashley knows how to use magically. I need a drink. Should Chainsaw Jones be wearing jorts? I feel like I need a good nickname for him. I just call him Double Chainsaw Guy for Mercenaries, but that's pretty lame. You could just call him Jones. Right, we gotta go back to the waste dis- Oh! You know what? Maybe I shouldn't... Shouldn't exit that... That place. Let's- let's go over here where it's clear. Oh no, he's actually there. Oh! Damn it, they didn't take out the important one. Run, Ashley! Ah! There's three of them. There's three- of course there's three of them. Wait. I'm gonna have to take him out. Wait. She's gonna have to wait here. I have to take them out myself. Look at him spin. We're fine. This is the worst room to fight. I get three Garadors in. Whew, just in time. Okay. Now for the important ones. No, they can't harm any more teddies. Don't worry. Follow me. That was actually a pretty scary room. Oh, no, you don't. You did not just try to fire a rocket at me. We have to babysit Ashley again, unfortunately. Run, girl, run! Jump down the trash. Who is the trash monster? Are you out of your mind? <gasps> oh, Ashley, you might want to move. You might want to move. Okay, two Magnum shots. Got him. Chainsaw Jones is back. He's dead, Ashley. That's what he is. Now, if you'd stop complaining, we could move on. <laughs> Chainsaw Jones. Hi. Oh, come on. I thought he was supposed to fall down first, but he was just waiting for me. Okay, yeah, he didn't- he ain't got much health. He ain't- he ain't crap. What is that thing? Come help me push this. That wasn't very nice, I know. He's probably the ones putting the bear traps down. That's how much of a bully he is. Okay, he didn't have much health. 
your butt out here. No need to really wait for him to go near the explosive barrels. Or need, no need to go get that stuff over there either. He doesn't need to, even need to do a wind-up animation to hit you with the chainsaw. He just needs to be near you. He has like a chrysogram animation with his chainsaw almost. Okay, we got village girls. Let's just take them out. This room can be annoying, and it seems like they don't have much health anyway. I need handgun. Oh boy, here we go. Look, there's a gate here. Holy moly. Oh, a lot of them. Light it. Light it. I might as well just take him out. For the dynamite. Okay, we're pretty safe. Put that down there. No, 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 I don't want that. Check. Ashley. Ah! Jeez, I didn't see that until it was too late. It takes all them out. Ashley operated again. Damn it. Cleffa would finish all the strawberry juice. Why would Cleffa do that? Why can't Cleffa just mind its own business? The enemies just don't stop coming here until you're really done with this, aren't they? Uh-oh. Hang on, can I pick anything up in here? Oh, they made it through anyway. Okay, not enough health on him, or I have too much firepower. Damn, I thought that would finish him. There we go. Well, loot is already kind of random for the most part. But, uh... Let me see here. It's mostly just enemies randomized with the merchant and all that. Auxiliary power has been restored. Open that. Can I carry this? No, I cannot, of course. I've done enough inventory management to last me a lifetime after today. Leave it to me, Leon. I'll leave it to you. Can I hold this? Put that there. I almost have full maximum health. Merchant is here and he was too stupid to take this merchandise. find what out select? what are you buying hmm what are you selling best to just sell stuff now is that old stranger is that old? 
Thank Stone you. of Faith. I might need the infrared scope if there's I multiple Iron Maidens, but not right now. What are you buying? Let's go to the TMP. Exclusive. 2.9 to 8.4. That's more than double. That's that's nearly triple. That's pretty damn good. I think we're pretty much set for the rest of the game now, aren't we? Not enough, not enough, not enough, not enough cash. Straight. What are you selling? What are you buying? Come back at any time. Did I close your poll? No, no, it just ended on its own, didn't it? That wasn't me. I swear. Hang on a second. I need to check something. Chat, every TMP bullet now has as much power as um, a magnum shot. <laughs> Almost. Almost. Considering how much they spray out like that. Fair and balanced. Wait. Two. Three. We did it. It's time for this thing now. Oh, I don't care anymore. Stop picking it up. I want more money. Or TMP, really. Well. Do I have a, do I have a full auto magnum now? That'd be pretty sick, but... We'll have to see how this goes. Usually I just get island boys at this part, or villagers, nothing fancy. I could probably just sell the Magnum, but what if I run out of TMP ammo? It's villagers. Too powerful. Can these guys even jump up this? Apparently they can. Oh god. How many of them up? All the clones are marching towards me. Hide it. Uh-oh. Wasn't a whole lot I could do to dodge that. Where's the truck? Oh, right, it's behind us. I thought it came from the front there. The farmers want you to know that the island belongs to them. I want them to know 8.9 power. No, it was 8.4. What am I saying? I ruined my joke. Can anyone confirm? Is this how giant trucks work? You, uh, you fire at their windows a couple times and they just burst into flames and fall over? That's how that works, I'm pretty sure. <clears throat> Pardon me, jeez. I wish that's how it worked in real life. <clears throat> Ouch. I'm trying to talk. Throat's a little gunky. Where are the enemies at? You're fine. Oh. She was not fine. Okay, those guys are fast, and they don't seem to focus only on Leon. So I should probably just pick them off from the beginning and protect Ashley. Ashley dies when she's killed, so we gotta be careful about that. Pretty sure they spawn when you go up the ladder. They're already on the thing! Oh, no, no, no. No, no, no. Uh-oh. The dynamite hits her. Oh, no. Okay. 
I think the thing to protect her first is I gotta take out the two dynamite guys that spawn in front of the two doors. But they only spawn as soon as I go up the ladder. This is kind of tricky. This is why you want to have the high firepower near the end in case you get dumb crap like this. This is a bad place for dynamite spawns. Yes, it is. Ashley died because she didn't hydrate. That's right. No, I'm stuck on the board. No, he got her first. Okay, for some reason, as soon as the enemies spawn, there's like one of them already on the back of the truck walking over to kill her. <laughs> okay, let's do it. Yes, yes, yes. Okay. Take him out. Ooh. Dude, they're already freaking on her. Where are they at? Where are they at? We got them all? I think we're safe. Oh boy. You made another poll. Who would bake who would bake the best cookies? I can't see who you put on the on the poll without tabbing out of the game, tell me. Not Ashley. Where? Oh, come on. Any more friends want to just jump onto it? Teddy, Cleffa, or Bellsprout? I think Teddy Ursa would bake good cookies. But I think he would sample a little too many of, co too many of the cookies while baking. Hmm. Well, this is annoying. God, I have no damn room. I want to just take that and reload. So you know what? I'll just get rid of the herb. I don't care. Discard it then. What? Where? Pull the lever. No one else hopping in? Good. Cleffa has stumpy hands. It can't make cookies. That's true. Cleffa would not be able to bake with those little, little, little beans that they have for hands. And Bellsprout would just spit on it. I feel like that's what Bellsprout would do. Cleffa can learn Psychic. Well, okay, you're changing the question now. If if Kleppa had psychic powers, yeah, of course it could freaking bake cookies better. But the, the, the poll says Kleppa, not a Kleppa that knows psychic, so ha. Kleppa's at 1% right now in the poll. Of course, no one believes in Kleppa in this chat. Farmer John, you gotta go. Okay, good. They just keep coming, and they don't stop coming. I love the power of this TMP, but I'm blowing through bullets real quickly. Hey, I look an answer. You okay? You got a floor bucket. Where? Oh, sorry. Your window should have worked better. Okay. You crashed and you're okay. Nothing in here. Merchant, my man, I'm begging you. Just, I, we're almost to the end of the game. Just sell me the damn case upgrade. Sell it to me. Now. 
Your selection. No. What are you buying? What are you buying? Not enough cash, stranger. What are hmm. you selling? Come back. Anyway. Nah, worth it. I need to have some space. What I need to sell selling? something. Is that all, stranger? Is that? <laughs> That was a very slow crash. Yes, it was. Next up, the seat. Chapter end, 3-2. 5,000 pitas. I hear people. Oh, our plan. Somebody's whispering. Teddy Ursa won the poll at 51%. Of course it did. Teddy always wins. We're gonna have to go through the Krauser's cutscene now. It's always fun. Take a little bit of rifle ammo for the trouble. Okay. Reload a little bit of rifle for our trouble. Just want to make sure I have ammo to spend. No reason to go up there in that room. We have more than enough stuff we can't hold anymore anyway. Chat, you're making me hungry for more cookies. I still have some more chocolate peanut butter ones left over. Hmm. Teddy won the poll because you contributed 69,000 Teddy points. Of course you did. Why wouldn't you do that? Okay, Krauser stuff done. Let's go through here. Um. Oh yeah, this is where we go. Sometimes I get lost at the end of that. Laser QTEs. Oh boy. They put the lasers in uh, Ada's DLC for the remake. Let's try this. Have you guys ever seen the death animation if you fail, if you fail this in uh, the remake? It's actually pretty brutal. Hang on. Check. Oh, I need to check the switch to the right. What happens is, like, with a big grid of lasers goes at Ada, and if you miss the QTE, they go through her, and then it just shows her standing there, and then you see, like, parts of her start to split apart, and then it cuts to game over. Ooh. Yeah, she gets- basically gets cubed like the dude in the first Resident Evil movie. Let's have a seat. Let's get a thumbnail. There's no time for resting. All right. Totally forgot about that up there. Sometimes you just want to sit in a fancy seat. Looks like we got to go deal with it now. It will keep you busy. Let me see now. Starting to think I should just ditch the Magnum. Or at least spend all of the Magnum shots on, um... On it, and then just sell it. Because at this point, I don't think I need the Magnum anymore. <laughs> like someone was saying, like, I, I got the, the Riot Gun and the TMP to, like, max firepower. Okay, then. I did not mean to do that. Oops. I got killed again. That's because it's on pro mode, and I've gotten no vest. 
in the merchant shop, so... Yeah, I basically have no defense. Wait, no, there is no vest in professional mode normally, right? I can't remember now. I think that might have been the case. No, no. No, I didn't want to just brighten this game. What are you doing? What, what are you doing? <laughs> I just wanted to close the... Oh. So I did enough damage for it to jump away. But it still grabbed me. That was stupid. This is why I don't waste bullets during this part. So whoever made this was not paying attention. Okay, there we go. Whatever, I'm just salty and tilted now. Let's get this part over with. I accidentally opened the pause menu and just went bleh. Now I can't hold it. Do that. Wait, what? Get out of the way. Get out of the way. It's gonna fall down again because I just hit the switch. Oh, man. Here we go. I only have so much TMP ammo. Hang on, I'm trying to remember which way to go because I'm tilted. There we go, it's this way. Yeah, tactical vest isn't in pro mode normally. Okay. Then I'm just losing my mind. I got to deal with it. I'm gonna have to go to full health, otherwise I'll die in another hit, but there's no heals. And I picked a really bad spot for this part, didn't I? We'll just have to make do with the overpowered TMP as a repellent for it. Just annoying because there's no checkpoint. No, I think it's going away. Oh, stuck. Okay, good. So if you actually spend bullets on it during the last uh, container, it just goes away? I didn't know that. I actually did not know that. That's that's good to know. Usually I just run by it and hope for the best, but I had the ammo this time. Hit the checkpoint at least. Sure, we'll take the Magnum. Okay. Revenge. You have a lot of health. Okay, pay attention for a sec. out of the ground. I should probably just finish it with the TMP. That'll be the best DPS for it. Any day now. Okay. Nice. I actually don't remember the normal firepower of the TMP when you, um, when you fully upgrade it and get the exclusive in a casual run. I got it to 8.4 with the randomized stats. So, that must be pretty damn good. I'm gonna sell the Magnum now, yeah. <laughs> I don't need it. Let's get the heck out of here. It kept me busy. It does not feel like I've been streaming this long today, jeez. 
This is the most fun I've had with an RE4 rando for a while. Um, fully upgraded TMP in the base game goes to like 2.4 damage. Ooh, quite a difference here, yeah. Sick. Got no extra reload. Usually when I get to the island part of a rando, a part of me is just like, oh yeah, let's let's finish this up already. But this one actually has some good randomization. Not as much island boys. Multiple chainsaw guys. Well, there's a lot of farmers during the construction part. Oh! Speaking of interesting seeds, chat, I just spotted another monster. We'll get him in a second first. Got him. They're climbing up. Let's get him. Let's get his ass. Fantastic. Tough. Stuck on the wall. They climb up and I hop down. They shouldn't be able to follow me. I hope. TMP ammo is stupid valuable right now. Hold up. Protect the bears. I already have max possible health. Uh-oh. Right, you gotta go through the tent. It's remake, you just walk that way. They're probably chasing me. I gotta run. Gotta run. There's no merch. The merchant got replaced with a bear trap. How could he? Yeah, I think I think mostly uh, many people would agree the island isn't exactly the best part of RE4. Nope, don't want that. It kind of feels like they just had, like, leftover assets, and they're like, yeah, just throw it in. That random military island? Yeah, that's a thing now. Okay, let's get through Krauser's part. He's a big boy. He can piss off for a little bit. It's the filler arc, almost. So, you two are... Run, Leon, run! Hmm. Take that. Uh, don't need that, really. Browser can't really be random, random here. Because this whole segment is, like, built around him. Nothing really... There we go. Damn it. Okay, he's gone. Let me just do this right quick. Yellow herbs are pretty worthless now. It's time to selling. We got him to go away. TMP reloaded. Don't need that shotgun, because I can't hold anything. One case upgrade, everybody. Trying our best to make it work, too. Oh, I went the wrong way. This is the ending. I tend to get lost during this part a lot. Let's just 
run up here so we can push the gargoyle statue. Browser needs to die first. Kick him. Good. Don't just stand there. Come out and fight like a man. I don't need to respond to you. You're a loser. Is he done yet? He seems to have a lot more HP than normal here. Okay, he's done. Now the gargoyle statue knows how to come out automatically. What happens if he respond? You just like say dialogue to him. This was 2005, AAA games were still kind of figuring out that, how to be like cool and cinematic. And in Resident Evil 6, uh, they were still figuring it out. <laughs> We need to push that gargoyle statue there, because as we all know, th those bars prevented us from moving moving this lever. Let's get out. Take a little green. Yeah, Seven was so cinematic. The first hour of the game is a movie you have to watch that's unskippable. That's an exaggeration, but... I love Seven, but I hate the intro. Oh. The intro is so long. Too powerful. No one can even stop the TMP. It's too powerful now. Okay, then. Dude, just throw one of these away. I want to carry my items, please. Eight was a little better for that, but you still have to hold forward and walk for a little bit at the start of the game. Any more Chainsaw Jones here? Rifle ammo and all that. Don't want this stuff. These guys are replacing the Krauser bombs. What is it that you fight for? Teddy Ursa. Oh. Yeah, that's just rude. Ah, there it is. I got a yellow herb, but it's pretty worthless. I may as well just combine it. I'm not going to sell them, though. Oh boy. Now it's time to take out Krauser the easy way. Where is it? Oh, it's over there. Or not. Am I losing my mind? Where is it? Oh, it's at the edge. I could have sworn it was in the middle. Prepare for your death. No. Ah, darn it. Okay. What? Ch chat, I, I got the dodge, right? I, I got the QTE. <laughs> what? I had it. <laughs> I'm just going to stick with that. He's not going to die instantly to instantly to the TMP. The thing that damages him the most is still the knife. Prepare for your death, Leon. I want to see if I could just kind of cheese him with that firepower, though. Ah, darn it. Go. Damn 
Damn. Oh. What? Oh, that was the exit. I didn't actually know that closed when you get out of there. There we go. That was annoying. That went on a little longer than it should have, in my opinion. Hang on, I have nothing to heal except this. Magnum ammo right there. He used to be such a good guy, didn't he? Krauser's kind of finicky in professional mode, in my opinion, yeah. I mean... I mean, it does sound a little, a little bit like I'm salty, but to be fair, you all did just see me do complete that QTE, and he still killed me anyway. <laughs> so, I am a little bit salty about that, not gonna lie. That's not the first time that's happened, too. Okay, secret lab. And now we go in... Yeah, secret lab hidden in the ruins. Let me get a drink. Let me wash the salt away. You spend all your resources at Krauser, but no. Ain't gonna do that. Okay, we're gonna have to run for it and be a wholesome bear. Is there a first aid spray hidden inside somewhere? That'd be nice. Nope. Tent will cover me. This is just take the lower path. I don't think I can hit him. stayed here. I'm gonna have to farm one of them for an, a herb drop. Yeah, I'm dead. now. Let's take this out. No! I'm surprised I'm even alive after that. That was stupid. Mike's actually taking out something. Let's do it. One of the few things he actually does for you in pro mode. This is such a bad room to not have heals for right now. No. Damn it, I almost got killed there. Please let there be a heal. No, no heal. Am I just boned? Or red? No, nope, I gotta use this. Damn. Somehow I'm still alive here. What? Oh boy. I hit the checkpoint. Hang on, I hit a checkpoint. That's good. I think the chain guy didn't... Is it gonna go? Whatever, I hit the checkpoint. Let's just roll with it. Take this. He replaced chain gun guy. 
This should be another checkpoint. Okay, we're actually doing this. I was really worried because this part is... Oops. As you can see, a little annoying. Yeah, do that. It's me at green. And going through here is another checkpoint. And now we pray that the game doesn't crash at the end. This, this is, this part right here is one of my favorite horror game moments. The part where you have to do the Call of Duty Siege <laughs> with Mike the Helicopter Pilot. Yeah, I know I got it, but man, this part makes me tilted right now because I, I didn't have enough heals to prepare for it. Okay. It's on me. I should have remembered it was coming up. I forgot that in OG, it's right after Krauser. Like, literally right after him. Bro. There we go. I thought I was hitting him for a second. I was scared. Okay, we do that. Let's do it. Watch the salt away, keep going. Hang on, is that TMP? Yes, it is, actually. Load this up. Let's just take them all out so they can't cause problems. I'm actually getting really lucky. None of these guys are crossbow dudes, so... There's that. Oh, hang on. I hate that I can't even save a herb. I have to use them as soon as I get them now. Could probably save this one. That's a first aid spray. Nice. You don't. I said, no, you don't. There you go. That guy was very solid, wasn't he? Getting them all out of the way while we can. Take the TMP ammo. Now we're gonna climb up over here. We're gonna go over to the other side. Okay, that's the last one. The music stopped. Uh, that guy's stuck in the wall. There we go. Now it's the last one. Please don't crash. Please don't crash. Please don't crash. That was actually pretty easy in terms of randomization settings, which I'm kind of thankful for, because this would have been poopy butts, <laughs> considering my health situation. Please don't crash. Please don't crash. Please don't crash. Please don't crash. <sighs> oh, thank God. That door infamously crashes all the time in the PC port. No. Okay. Looks like we're good, everybody. Looks like we are good. Hmm. Mike's dead, by the way. I wish we could say we miss him, but in professional mode, he blows up that one building and never gives you any cover fire. So, yeah. Sorry, Mike. You may have known a good bar, but in this, I wish you would have known how to aim... So passive to Mike now. Not much more of the game left now, Teddies. Take the Pearl Pendant. What am I looking at for ammo? I was gonna sell the, the Magnum, but I'm not running out of ammo for everything. And it takes care of that.
haven't seen any Iron Maidens yet. Probably should loot for some more stuff. We'll take it. Okay. Hope you're all still enjoying, chat. We're almost to the end of this. Though it does tend to feel like the the island's a bit of an underwhelming finale in, for the randomizer. Most of the fun, I feel like, happens in the castle and the village. There's too many, like... I don't want to say scripted, but stuff like the construct... Using the construction bulldozer or whatever the hell it is. Um... Like, you know, the mic siege, the Krauser part. Like, a lot of parts that can't even be randomized, like Sadler. Kind of kind of makes it less interesting in a rando, but still fun. Like, we can have plenty of chainsaw guys chasing me. Regenerators got replaced with Krauser bots. Or Krauser dynamite, I should say. Oh yeah, U4 also can't be... Or no, sorry, it's U3. Can't be randomized either. So those fights are kind of too dis too importantly designed around their own arenas, so they can't, like, be changed without breaking the game. Will I be finished by, by the next year? Yep. Oh, is this the final room? Let's do it. Let's use some rifle for a little bit. Whoa! They were here real quickly. Okay, fellas, you want to play like this? We'll play like that. This is the last big siege room in the game, and it looks like all I got was big- was just bald guys. That was a headshot, right? Uh, the game said it was, so I won't argue, but... do this. Took his head off and made him go boom. Yeah, I don't want to take that. These are worthless to me. I think I should just start saving the rest of my TMP ammo to kind of finish off Sadler quickly. Let's do it. It seems to be that, like, I always get island boys for this one room. It's always just, like, one type of island boy shuffled to- not shuffled together, just, like, grouped together. Operate. Yeah, they're all coming. Let's take him out. Teddy style. I definitely shot that guy's shoulder, but the game said otherwise. Ouch. Oopsie. I'm seeing too much of this bald guy's face. Okay, fellas. Okay, fellas, I can see that lining you up isn't going to work for you anymore, so we'll just switch to the boomstick. Oh, hey, the keycard one was there. You know what would be a cool option for the randomizer, actually? Not that I'm, like, demanding this be made or anything, but you know what would be actually pretty awesome? What if... What if, like, there was a randomization setting where every time you entered a new room, your entire inventory was random, and you just had to beat the room with whatever you got? That'd be sick. Okay, put that there. Check this. If I hear them make that noise again, I'm getting real tired of it. 
That'd be a challenge. It'd be similar to that one, like, uh, that was made for small ants for Pokemon, where, um, every time you do a battle, your entire team is randomized into something else. There's the key card thing. What did I say? Okay, the army of the bald guys is dealt with. We can move on. <laughs> now to go for the second one, which I think was over here. Yeah, there it is. Hang on. Should reload this. 154, that's not bad. The last big room in the game is done. I tend to never get like anything like chainsaw guys in this room. That'd be that'd be awesome though. Imagine if it was just fully filled with double chainsaw lads and you just had to deal with all that. Uh is this it? Right, I remember where to go now. Let me just put this right here. I don't need the handgun ammo, but I guess I picked it up. Hey, Ashley, what's up? Okay. Um, I should sell stuff first. Hang on. Welcome. If he sells the case now, Got a there's an option in the randomizer to set harder enemies. Can make those double chainsaw guys. Well, there, I don't see an option for that. Is in the, the, is that in like the brand new build or something? Because the only option I see is for guarantee safe enemies that won't crash the game. I don't see anything about harder enemies. Wait, wait, wait. you have to right click. It's like hidden. Really? It's the this is the first I'm hearing about it. Damn. Uh, I don't think I would have done that tonight, though. I probably would need, like, to set aside even more time. What are you selling? Why would they do that? That's so Is weird. That <laughs> the menu is already so small for generating a seed. I may as well just sell the infrared scope, to be honest. Just taking up space. I did not know that. Are you bamboozling me? I will check after the stream, and if I'm, ban if I'm bamboozled, I'll get you. What are you Tune up. What are you selling? Sell the killer seven. <laughs> Thank you. What are you buying? And with our remaining money. <laughs> Thank you. Rifle's got 13.0 speed and super good firing speed. Dead serious could post a screenshot. Okay, I, I believe you. But that's really strange. What is what does this option do? Like, does it just say harder enemies, or do you know actually any specifics of what it can do? Come back anytime. Next time I play this, I'll just put in brackets, like, with harder enemy settings or something like that. Maybe I'll do that on normal mode, though, because pro is... Pro is fun, but, like... Oh, it's Chief Mendez. No, it's dogs. No, it's Chief. Hang on. Now I have space, chat. Follow me. Wait. Okay, he's dead. Is he gonna drop? Nope, he's gone now. Now let's get out. Last chapter. Uh, New Year is actually like an hour away from me. Damn. Damn. Chat, will I finish this by the end of the year? Post, uh, post a poll down there. I don't think it's going to take me an hour to beat Sal Sadler. Don't think it'll take me that long. Just a hunch. Got nothing else to reload that with. 
you right click it's under random HP range and you can make it high harder so you can make random HP values even higher damn makes enemies have more health I'm pretty sure it makes more difficult enemy spawn as well that's really strange can you right click any of the other options for more stuff dude I had no idea you could do this at all hang on I don't know why I'm heading up here. Just for the red herb? Is that all that's there? Don't need that. Blech. I went back through the wrong door. I didn't even realize you could, like, actually go back. I thought it was still blocked off during Ada's thing. Whatever. Alright, catch you later, friend. Hope you enjoyed the stream. Yeah, we gotta go this way now. Then through this. That's the only thing that pops up if you right-click something. There, unless you want an option to undo the rando seed. Okay. I can't- why would they hide that, though? That's so strange. I've literally been doing this for, like, playing randos of this um, on and off for, like, two years, and this is the first I've ever heard of that option. That is unbelievable to me. I wonder if anyone watching this also playing it is, is surprised. There's nothing else we can really upgrade, so we may as well buy health items to finish this off. I'm gonna take a gold chicken egg. Thank you, take one of these as well. Whoopsie. <laughs> I really should have bought more health items early on to prepare for the mic section. <laughs> Is that all? He has seven available still. <laughs> all right, let's just let's just go with this. We'll be fine. Back the blueberries are pretty worthless right now, too. In fact, I'm going to throw one away. I'm not even going to sell it. Doesn't seem to be well documented in the rando, yeah. Okay, let's fight Sadler. Just hit his body for a bit. Oh, I popped it. I hit one of the eyeballs with just one TMP round and bam. Let's get him. Usually only do the harder settings when you're also using a trainer to play as Krauser and swap melee for Hunk's Neckbreaker because the enemies do get kind of spongy. Okay. Yeah, there is a mod that lets you um, play as Hunk, right? Or use his moveset, I believe. Because he's available in Mercenaries mode, so there should be a setting to just actually play as him. I think one of my mods mentioned that I should try that sometime. Just do a randomizer with um, a, a, another mod on top that lets you play as Hunk. That'd be kind of sick. Oh, even better if you could play as Wesker, too. Use his melee options. Let me see. Using Hunk's Neckbreaker would trivialize a lot of rooms, yeah. But it'd be fun. Is he done yet? Just hit him with one little eyeball. I feel like that would be like an easier mod to make that more people would use. Just play as, um, play as Hunk. Oh! Damn, that's annoying. Yeah, the neckbreaker kills everything, like double chainsaw guys and JJ. He's stupid good. Where he at? Okay, he's going over there. Ow. No, no, no. No, no, no! Oh my goodness, I thought I was gonna die from that. He had me stunlocked. That was really silly. 
probably should just use a quick heal again. You know what? This one will use the lime. Get a free stab on his face. I was thinking at some point I would do a hunk only stream of just playing hunk mini games and mercenary modes with him. But yeah, it's so weird that that option for the randomizer to make things harder is hidden. Because I've never heard any streamer mention that. That's so strange. Okay, stopped him a little bit by shooting him. Speaking of damage sponges, Sadler can really be that way in this game sometimes. Hit an eyeball. Let's get away from him now. Hmm. I throw one of these. Hit him enough, he's fallen down. Uh oh. There it is. Oh no, chat, I just realized. I need to make room for it. Go, 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 go. Everyone's favorite favorite anticlimactic moment. It's a good thing I sold the Magnum, isn't it? Oh. <laughs> oh, here we go. Here we go. Hang on, everybody. <laughs> Hang on. Here, let's just throw away the rifle. I don't need that anymore, right? Yes, sir, little buddy. Need him to hop over here now so we can just finish him off. You got a jet ski key. Let's do it. It's time to go, Ashley. We gotta get home. Uh, where? There it is. I had to throw away one of my weapons. <laughs> I was thinking about to sit there for a while. Game is done, so don't worry. And that'll be painful. It's New Year for you. Ooh, I just got like an hour for me, yeah. Oopsie. Tried to skip that. Okay, let's get on the jet ski and go greet the New Year, everyone. Nice, long, comfy rando. I don't know if this part is actually different on, uh, on Professional. Sweetheart. Does he have it memorized? Can he do it first try again? Just gonna hold forward, but... Careful not to bump anything. They let you get control of the jet ski at first. I'm gonna go for a ride. Side, go to the side, go to the side. We made it. What's my final rank? Tell me. Mm. 
Rescue mission complete. Hit ratio. Ooh, nice. Number of times I got killed. Okay, let's be real. That a lot of at least 55 of those weren't my fault. <laughs> Seven hour 40 minutes? That doesn't sound right. No. Now you can buy the infinite rocket launcher. Yeah, sure, let's make a save. That one was pretty fun. I actually had... That was probably the most random I've ever seen the island. Okay. Let me go ahead and just stay on the load screen for a second here. Or no, we can just go back to the title screen. Okay. And that was a professional mode run for the Resident Evil 4 randomizer. I had... That was pretty fun. It was a little difficult at first, obviously, because pro mode. Um... The biggest thing with pro mode I feel that I completely forgot about and did not prepare for was the mic section. I'm really glad I got easy enemies for that because I, I went in there with like no heals and he was not helping because he can't in that mode. Um, Let's see here. No vest I was allowed to get. I didn't have the best luck with the merchant. I should have taken better advantage of the fact that he had a bunch of heals for sale. I just didn't really pick them up. But it's, it's whatever. This was probably one of the most fun seeds I ever had, though. Especially during the first half, we had a lot of moments that were just very memorable. Like chainsaws sneaking up on me. Just a lot of parts that got me jump scared. This is probably the most times we've had a Garador spawn as well. No Iron Maidens this time, though. I noticed that. Had some funny Krauser moments, too. Um, and yeah, apparently there's an option to make the randomizer a little bit harder as well, which I didn't know. Apparently it's hidden. I Maybe next time, if I remember, I'll try that, but if I do that, maybe I'll just do it on normal mode. Just because, I don't know, because a professional, I feel like I, I'd have to, like, it would take me a little, a little bit longer. And these are already, like, seven to eight hour streams to complete this in one go. But... This is where we're going to wrap this up because it's quite late. Let me see here. Let me get this. If you're watching on YouTube, I hope you had a great time with this. This is another special little New Year Resident Evil 4 stream. Hopefully you enjoyed and you'll check out another one. But have a good night and bye-bye.